why'd you come in here? Andre make you sleep in the living room again. Oh, he's gonna send me to an early grave. How did it get so late? Shoot, I gotta get out of here. Tasha? Tasha? Girl, what are you doing outside so early? Oh, I was getting some fresh air. Nothing gets me going like the smell of gum powder in the morning. Honey, my good blouse is hanging out on... I already ironed it for you, and I made Dion's lunch, and I started the coffee. Mm. Mama, look, I have to talk to you about something really important. Later, darling, right now. Just get him washed and dressed for Mama. me. Mama! Please. Please. Go on, Dion. Come on. Come on, Dion. Come on. She's not going to run out on you in her dumb bathrobe. Look at my baby. He looks so sweet when he's asleep. Hey! Get up! No, Mom's chill. Mom's, I'm naked. So? I've seen everything you got. I made everything you got. But what did I tell you about making Dion sleep in the living rooms? Oh, come on, Ma. Ever since you got him, I ain't slept a wink. Every night he's making those noises. The foster place should have given you a warranty on him. Should have gotten a warranty on your pointy butt. Now get up! That's your problem. You always down on a brother. That's why you never have any dates. Man, I don't want any dates with no Nintendo playing, trash talking, pants hanging off they butt wearing underachievers such as yourself. I don't play Nintendo. Genesis John Madden Football 93. That's my game. Those girls who actually go out with you? You better believe it. I do real well with the honey dips. You do what with the honey dips? Uh, I treat them with the utmost respect at all times. Boy, it's a wonder your lips don't fall off your face when you lie like that. <laughs> Mama, look, can I talk to you now? Tasha, throw these in the washing machine, will you? And honey, make sure that you run them on the, the delicate, delicate cycle. cycle. I yes. know, I know. Come on, Dion, take that. Come on. Eat up. Andre, will you pull up those pants, please? Nobody wants to see your rusty behind. <laughs> I need you to take Dion to school this morning. Hey, why can't you do it? It's right on your way to work. Or I could do it, because I go that way, too, so. <laughs> Yo, D, it's going to be me and you today. High five. Low five. How about you just sit there and do nothing? <laughs> yeah, that's my boy right there. Mama, look, can I talk to you now, please? Yes, baby, what is it? Okay, 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 see, there's this sweet cross-color jacket. I don't have it. But you don't even know what I'm gonna say. I know it's gonna end with give me some money. Yeah, well, Mama, see, this jacket is tall. Oh, man, that bitch is fine. <gasps> Excuse me? Mama! Did I just hear you call someone a bitch? Oh, Ma, I didn't mean it like that. It's just an expression. You know, like girl, woman, bitch. I see. They're all interchangeable. Is that it? Am I a bitch? Is your sister a bitch? Can I answer those separately? Hey, hey, chill, girl. How you know I meant you? Oh, I did meet him, Ma. <laughs> 
just better watch your mouth in my house, understand? Mama, look, can you let me finish now? See, this jacket's on sale at Oak Tree to Friday, 50% off. Fine. All you need now is the other 50%. Man, my daddy give me the money. Then get it from your dad. All you gotta do is find his trifling ass. <laughs> That's enough out of you. Hello? No, Vanessa, there's no one named Dre here. I do, however, have a son named Andre. Oh, uh, what's up? Why you tripping? You just keep it in your pants, boy. <laughs> I don't want you bringing home no little nappy-headed babies. <clears throat> don't worry, Ma. Vanessa's got a weave. <laughs> Guess you on that one, didn't it? Hello, Vanessa. Hey, baby. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, Mama, look, I have a great talking. idea. You don't have to give me the money. You can just loan it to me. You ain't with Mama. Mama, hey, are Vanessa. you listening to me? All I want to do is zoom, 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 in a boom, boom, boom. Oh. Hi, Vanessa. It's Andre's mother again. No, I'm not gone yet. Andre wants you to know he's a virgin. What? And plans to stay that way till he's 21. <laughs> That's right. You're welcome. <laughs> Uh, 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 Vanessa? Oh, no, don't worry about that. You know she was just tripping, right? <laughs> Mars, what's up? What's up is that I'm not going to let you ruin your life by getting some little fast tell 16-year-old girl pregnant. Oh, come on, man, that was just talk. I don't have no privacy in this house. Get myself a beeper, and I won't have this problem no more. A beeper? Boy, the day you get a beeper is the day after you become a doctor. Or a drug dealer. Shut up! Man, don't tell me Hey, look, girl, don't put up Everybody season. shut up! <laughs> now, you are not getting a beeper, and that is that. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Yeah. I said, yeah. All right, shoot, I'm late. I gotta get out of here. So, Mama, look, what about my jacket? Baby, I told you, I don't have any money to loan you. Mom, what do you mean? Didn't you get paid Friday? It's none of your business when I got paid, little girl. Why are you being so selfish? Forget it. Okay, Dion. I will pick you up at 3 o'clock. You're having dinner with your mentor tonight, right? Yeah, Ray's right. coming over by 5.30. Then you bring your butt straight home after school. And when he drops you off, you bring your butt straight in the house. Is there anything else you like my butt to do? <laughs> Keep talking, and you're going to be digging my size 9 shoe out of it. Mrs. Mosley, come in. So, Terry Beaker speaks very highly of you. He said you're the real reason that LA Unified's been one of our top accounts. Heck, I knew he couldn't be the reason. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm curious, Mrs. Mosley. Why do you want to leave your job with the school district to become a sales rep for scientific supplies? Well, actually, I was laid off about a month ago. Part of all the budget cutbacks. Apparently, my $500 a week put them $20 million in the red. <laughs> <laughs> And how long had you been working as a purchasing manager there before they cut you loose? Thirteen years. Although I wasn't technically the purchasing manager, I was secretary to the purchasing manager. Okay. The truth is, I practically ran the department. Hell, they could have fired him and kept me. They would have saved a lot more money. <laughs> oh, I see you attended USC. What did you earn your degree in? Well, actually, I had to drop out just a few credits short of a degree. Oh, how many? Oh, let's see. Um, one, two, approximately 116. <laughs> now, I had to drop out when my husband and I separated. Mm, well, Mrs. Mosley, I... Mr. Spain, I can do this job. I'm sure you can. Mr. Spain, I'm not the type to beg anyone for anything, but I've been out of work for over a month, and I'm down to my last dime. My kids don't even know what's going on. They think I'm at work right now. Please, just consider giving me this job. Look, I... Just like consider it, please. Because what Terry Beaker told you was the truth. Okay. I'll consider it. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. It's very considerate of you to consider it. <laughs> See, brother, 
By joining the Ujamaa Co-op, not only are you going to save on your food bill, but the money you do spend stays right here in our own community. And that, my brother, and that, my brother, is what last year's rebellion was really all about. Rebellion? Shoot. What went on here last year was a damn riot. <laughs> no, no, no. You see, brother, when, 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 when people resist a racist and oppressive power structure, hmm? it's a rebellion. Yeah, well, when they resist my damn car, it's a damn riot. Now get out of my damn way. <laughs> damn Jesse Jackson wannabe. Huh? I'm going to need cash back. Sorry, I can't take your check. Why? Is the food free today? Ha ha, no. <laughs> your name is on the return list. Joe Mosley, cash only. Honey, I don't care if my name is underlined, capitalized, and up in neon lights. I don't write bad checks. Don't get an attitude with me, lady. Well, then you get somebody else over here because I got an attitude and somebody's going to experience it. Mira, no empiece conmigo porque yo no juego, okay? Whatever. <laughs> Woman, you got busted. Now, pay the girl or, or get out the damn way. I'm gonna miss my bus. Then why don't you take your food stamps to another line? There ain't no other line. <laughs> is there a problem here, sister? I am not your sister, and yes, there is a problem. I have been shopping here since you opened, while most people go buy from the white folks. I wish I had gone and bought from the white folks. <laughs> and I think that I deserve better treatment than to be accused of bouncing a check when I know I didn't bounce any check. Her name is on the list. Was I talking to you? Was I talking to you? Damn, my bus just left. Get over it. Now, sister, calm down. Rage is not the answer, my sister. Stop calling me sister. I think I'd remember if you lived in my mama's house. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mrs. Mosley, but the check you wrote us on Monday was returned to us by your bank. Monday. See, there's the mistake. I know for a fact that your checks don't go in till the end of the week. Not anymore. Now we deposit the checks the same day we get them. Oh. Somebody needs some food stamps. <laughs> I'm sorry I lost my temper. Mm-hmm. Look, if you'll just deposit that check again tomorrow, it'll be good. I promise. Okay, sister. And uh, I'll just pay cash today. No problem. No problem. Um, I'm going to have to put a few things back. Dion, go put those cookies back and we got them from baby. your brother. <laughs> Tasha, baby, get me the baking pan, will you? And then get these dishes cleaned up and put away, okay? Yeah, just like I do every other sitting in the place. Anything else? Want me to paint the house now? Now listen, I know you're upset about not getting your jacket. But that is no excuse for you to start acting a fool in my house. Do I make myself clear? It ain't even about the jacket, Mama. Do I make myself clear? Yes. May I go do my homework? Go. Come on, baby, eat your soup. Yo, D, 
Hey, what's up, little homie? Yeah. <clears throat> what's going on, Moss? Hold it. Back it up. So, how was your day today? Do anything special? Anything hype? Anything dope, my brother? No, my mother. <laughs> uh, look, Ma, I gotta go. Ray's gonna be here any minute, so I got Wait, 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 wait. Just chill for a minute. Oh, man, I gotta get this watch fixed, man. Andre, how could you get a beeper, especially after I told you not to? Ma, I just wanted one. What the hell do you need a beeper for? Don't you turn your back on me, boy. What do you think I need it for? I don't know I what to think. Door. Now that you're going around sneaking behind my back, lying to my face, you could be up to any damn thing. What do you want? Ray, I'm sorry. Come in. Hi, Joan. Hey, Andre. My man. I got us a couple of Kings tickets for the night. Say, Joan, I uh, brought you a little something. No big deal. Yeah, I just thanks. Thought... Put them anywhere. Okay. Yeah, I'm up out of here. Hey, come on, let's go, Raymond. Good idea. You're not going anywhere. Bad idea. <laughs> Ma, why are you bugging? It's just a lousy old beeper. Andre, don't play me stupid. You know damn well what kind of slime and scum carry around beepers. <laughs> Sorry. Must be one of my patients. See? A lot of regular people have beepers, too. In this neighborhood, it's the gangbangers and the drug dealers, and I am not going to let you get your little narrow black ass shut off because you look like one of them. Look, Ma, I got the beeper so I can have some privacy, OK? I mean, you got me sharing a room with him. Sweat everybody who calls me here, and all day at school everybody was dissing me because they think I'm a virgin. Think nothing. You better be. He ain't got much of a choice. Yes, I do. Look, Ma, I got my priorities straight, but you don't want to believe it. You treat me like I'm a little kid or something. I do not. Ma, everybody sees it. Even Ray. He says you're afraid to let me grow up. <clears throat> well, the, the lad does have a point. Stay out of it, Ray. Don't want to be in it. Now, you listen to me. As long as I'm paying for the roof over your head, you're going to do like I tell you. Now, give me the beeper. No. Don't play with me, boy. I ain't playing. Give me the damn beeper, Marcus. I'm not Marcus, Ma. Bye. You do what you want. I don't care. I'm through with it. Anything happened to you? I don't want to know about it. I'm gonna get any of this food I'm cooking. Yeah. Who the hell is that? This journey? Girl, I thought it was either the Jehovah's Witnesses or those cookie pushing Girl Scouts. Either way, somebody's gonna catch a bullet. Go ahead and shoot me, sweets, because I just can't take it. <laughs> all right, girlfriend, you tell me all about it. Excuse me. I have to have a little chat with my breath. If you rub my yeah. don't turn out that damn noise, I'm gonna get ugly! Too late! <laughs> damn smart ass little. You want some kids? Girl, I was about to ask you the same thing. You know what Andre did? He went and got himself a beeper. Now can you imagine? A black boy in this neighborhood, LAPD everywhere. I mean, why not just carry a sign? I'm young, I'm black, I'm stupid, shoot me. <laughs> what the hell does he need a beeper for? Claims he needs it so his little girlfriends can get a hold of him. Oh, I can see that. Well, face it, Johnny, that boy is fine. Shoot. 
Ray just better mint some sense into his thick skull because I can't deal with it. And that's another thing. Where does that man get off bringing me flowers every week? Get off? That man is a doctor. I don't know why you don't just give him some, marry him, and call it a day. He doesn't turn me on, sweets. Honey, right now you ought to be worrying about how you're going to turn your lights on. And Tasha? I could just wring her little neck. Slamming things around, bothering me about money for some damn jacket when she knows full well I'm out of work. Tasha knows you're out of work? No, she doesn't, but the child ought to know better. Now, you just slow yourself down a little bit, girlfriend, because you know you're not right. I don't need to slow myself down. There's nothing wrong with me. It's everybody else who's screwed up. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, you a fine mess. I don't need this. Goodbye, sweet. I just wish it would all stop for a while, you know? Yes. I do, I do. Come on. Sit. Poor Tasha. All she wanted was a new jacket. And I got mad at her and called her selfish. She's about the least selfish girl in the world. I don't know. I'd give anything to be able to bring her home that jacket tonight. And Andre. I know he thinks I don't trust him, that I treat him like a baby, but what am I supposed to do? When I was arguing with him tonight, suddenly, suddenly all I could think about was Marcus and how I wished to God I had done more to keep him away from those gangbangers. They killed my boy, sweets. Those monsters killed my boy. If I lost Andre, too, I don't... I know. I know. You know, I know. Tell me. You're a beautiful, smart, strong woman. You've got wonderful children who love you very much. You've been to hell and back and back again, but you've got to believe we can make things change for the better. Because believing that is all we got. And here, I was going to use this to take those little crumb snatchers to the movies, but the hell with them, calling me ugly. <laughs> take it. No. Take it. No. How much is it? <laughs> hey, sweet stuff. Take and put these in the refrigerator for me. And you may take one cookie. I fixed you a plate. Want me to go get it for you? Later. Mm. Okay, if I watch 90210, my homework's all finished. Hey. I put that jacket on layaway for you. Thank you, Mama. Thanks. Don't be thanking me. You're going to have to keep up the payments. Watching them uppity white folks again? <laughs> Boy, you are getting so big. <laughs> Let the machine pick it up. You know what to do. Peace. Ms. Mosley, this is Bobby Devers from the Ujamaa Co-op. Swing by here tomorrow if you get a chance. I become aware of an opportunity that might help you out with your problem. And see you soon. Hey, Mom, about that beeper. 
We'll talk about it tomorrow, baby. in the morning and I'm hungry, about to eat this chicken to keep from being bony before hey, your mama... Give me this, man. You're spitting all over it. <laughs> Here you go, Dick. Dre, man, you ought to kick it with me at the High Life tonight. Man, you know my moms won't let me out on no school night. Hey, man, I'm gonna be up on the mic, man. You're gonna be with me. Man, honey's gonna be all over your tip, man. You're gonna be all that and a fat bag of Doritos. <laughs> hey, man, I can't do it, man. Moms will kick my ass. And if she found out you were gone, she'd kick yours, too. <laughs> Hey, man, my own mama don't even whoop me. Yeah, it's hard to do that from prison, you know? <laughs> hey, Dre, I don't like playing the mama jokes, man. But I do like playing with your mama. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, she's right behind you, too. Look at you, you little chicken. It's messed up, Dre. It's messed up. <sighs> Yo, what up, T? What up, Munchkin? What up? What's the deal with the kid? Oh. I guess he's one of them quiet crack babies, huh? Yeah, man, he's quiet, but he's not deaf, so chill, damn. Better find a pipe, homie, be chirping like a bird. <laughs> Wouldn't you, homie? You deserve that. Where's his breakfast? Mom said you were supposed to fix him something to eat. Chill, girl, I just poured him a bowl of cereal. Give me that. If you're so hungry, take your freeloading butt down to Denny's. Now, you know they don't serve us down there. <laughs> Mama! Hey, no, 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 Tasha, no, 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 don't do that. Tasha, what on earth are you screaming about now, child? Andre let his stupid friend eat up all the food in the whole house, and Dion is starving. Andre, that chicken was for dinner. Rashad, would you wait for Andre outside, please? I need to speak with my children. Yeah, get your butt out. I'll be finishing the set. Boy, get your butt out. Sure, no problem. You mind if I take this? Check in the set, Robotech. Yeah, peace out, man. Andre, Tasha, we need to talk. Sit down, please. Why do I have to sit down? He's the one that brought that greedy fool in here. Well, yeah, your friends would be here, too, if you had any. <sighs> shut up! Hey, girl, you had you back on me up, you shut up! <laughs> Sit down and listen. You remember when the school district made all of those cutbacks last month? Mm -hmm. Well, I was one of the cutbacks. I lost my job. 
But don't worry. Everything is fine. I've got some good prospects. Mama, they fired you? But why you? Oh, Tosh, what you mean, why? They always fire the niggas first. Andre, don't use that word. Mama, why didn't you tell us you got fired? Baby, I didn't tell you because I didn't want to worry you. I ain't worried. I'm mad. Are we going on welfare? No. Hell no. <laughs> I'll straight jack somebody before you catch me in a county line. You can't even jack Dion. Hey, look, everybody stop it. Now I'm going to get a job. I have always worked and I'm going to get a job. I promise. So everybody just calm down. All right? Why don't you just ask Daddy to help us? Yeah, go ahead, call him, Tasha. And I'm sure he'll come running Andre. over here with big old bags full of money, just like he always does when Andre. he needs something. Look who's talking, Mr. Out. Jack somebody. Well, if I have to jack somebody, I will. You hey, know? I'm gonna jack somebody if you all don't cut it out. She always act like Daddy gonna help us. He ain't gonna help us. Andre. Oh, he will? All right, cool. Dion. Here, call him. Oh, I forgot. You don't even know where his sorry ass is. Andre! I hate you! Andre, boy, what is wrong with you? You can't tear your sister down like that. You know how she feels about her father. Shh. Look, we got to stick together and support each other. Look at me. You're the man in this family. We need you to act like a man. Do you understand? Yeah. All right. Then the first thing I want you to do just go on in there and apologize to your sister. All right, Mom. But we got bigger problems than Tasha. I mean, like, you ain't got no job, and we ain't got no food. And come 6 o'clock tonight, I'm going to be starving like Marvin. <laughs> Boy, you could go without eating for a week and still grow. Look, the man from the co-op left me a message. I think he's going to give me some credit. Credit? Man, well, that's whack. No, that's not whack. That's good, Marvin. And I want you to take that beeper back like I told you. No argument. And why are you hiding hey, it down hey, here? ain't hiding it down. You're going too low. I ain't hiding it. <laughs> Look, I'll take it back. I may need you to pick up Dion on your way home from school. Well, how am I supposed to know if you want me to do that or not? I'll beep you. Hey, but you... then you take that thing back tomorrow. All right. African-American Journal. Man, what is this African-American stuff? I was just getting used to being black. <laughs> you something else, Mel. If you don't like the term African-American, then what would you prefer to be called, Mel? Well, on payday, Bobby, they usually call me sir. And when I put cash in the church plate, I'm a good brother. But when I finish paying my bills, I'm just another poor-ass Negro. <laughs> Mr. Devers. Mrs. Mosley, thank you for coming. I got your message, you know, about uh, helping me with my problem. I assume you were talking about credit. No, 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 I'm not talking about credit. Can we talk about credit? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we have a seat over here for a second, sister? Morning. Mm-hmm. So. You are unemployed at the moment, is that correct, sister? Quit tiptoeing around, Bobby. The woman was in here yesterday putting Brillo pads back on the shelf. <laughs> what exactly do you want, Mr. Devers? Well, Mrs. Mosley, I happen to know of a job opportunity that may appeal to you. A job? Well, that's great. What kind of job? Where is it? Here. You mean here as in this community, or...? <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean here as in this co-op. Oh. I've just created an assistant managerial position. It involves bookkeeping, bagging groceries, community relations, other miscellaneous Bag Bagging things. groceries? <laughs> Look, <laughs> only when we're busy, sister. And how much does this job pay, Mr. Devers? $350 a week. $350? I was making $525 on my last job. Look, sister, I know it's not a lot. But you have to understand, this is a cooperative venture. So I urge you to embrace the idea of Ujima and contribute to the economic and spiritual empowerment of our community, my sister. Not for 350, my brother. Oh, okay, hold on, Mr. Mosley. Look, I'm prepared to go as high as 375, but you definitely have to bag groceries. Bobby, could I have a word with you, please? Uh, one second, Mr. Mosley. 
What is it, Lucille? Yo no voy a trabajar con esa jodona, ¿ok? Olvídate de eso ahora mismo. No voy a hacerlo. 365, ¿qué te pasa? ¿Te fuiste loco? Yo she's no voy telling a... him how honored she's going to be to work with you. No, no voy a hacerlo. No, olvídate, no. Excuse me, but I can probably save both of you some trouble. Mr. Devers, I'm sorry if I seem ungrateful, but a job bagging groceries is really not the kind of thing I was looking for. Good. The fact is that for the last few weeks, I've been interviewing for positions that pay me almost twice what you're offering. Well, either you didn't get any of those positions or you're late for work. Look, Miss Nose, why don't you just take a few days and think it over, my sister? Thank you, but that really won't be necessary. Goodbye, Mr. Devers. Hi, is this, uh... Beverly? Yeah, this is a Tasha Mosley, James Mosley's daughter. Remember I called you a couple of months ago to see if... Yeah, I know he doesn't live with you anymore. I just thought he might have called you to give you his new number. What? Well, you can kiss my natural black... Hello? Hello? <laughs> yeah, whipping it up. Yo, D, taste this stew I hooked up for you, little bro. No, 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 come on. Oh man. Damn! What the hell I put in there anyhow? Man, why doesn't Dad ever let me know where he is? Because he don't know. What are we going to do if Mama doesn't find any work? I mean, I'm not going to be nobody's welfare recipient. Hey, Tosh, stop worrying about that. Look, I'm taking care of everything. Hey. I'm serious. We're gonna be all right. Hey, little sis. You okay? I'm okay. <laughs> all right. Where did all this food come from? I, I know mama didn't give you no money. Now look, I told you to stop talking like that. I'm taking care of everything. Hey, Tosh, you rolling with the rush. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Will you let me get in the door first? Sorry. So did you get a job? <laughs> no, baby, not today. But I got some good leads that I'm going to check out tomorrow. <clears throat> where did all this food come from? I bought it. And where did you get the money? Oh, well, I don't know. Let me just see what else I got in here. Bam, baby, look at this. <laughs> Mine. Now, it was five, but I spent the rest on the food. And, of course, I'm gonna hook my homies up. Here, Tosh. Decided to get you a sleeve on that jacket. <laughs> Here, D. Go put it down, paving on some voice lessons, because you don't be talking, you know what I'm saying? So, Ma, uh, you hungry? Oh, let me hook you up with some of this good food. All right, where did you get this money? I just got it, all right? Andre, where did you get this money? Did you do anything illegal? Oh, no, I'm not stupid. Yeah, and you're not smart enough to make $500 in one day either. Look, Mom, I got it, now you got it. That's all you need to know. Now come eat your food before it gets cold. Boy, don't you use that tone with me. You're not grown yet. Mom, one minute you want me to be grown, and now you're all in my face like I'm a little kid or something. Look, where I got the money is my own business. Now you got it. Dad, I thought you would be grateful. Boy, if you don't start talking, I'm gonna flush this money down the toilet. Go on, flush it, it's your money. <laughs> you know? Hey, Tosh, she's just bluffing. I know moms ain't that crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mom! Mom! Oh! Mom! Oh, no! Oh, mom, few 20s got away from me. But what's wrong with you? We need this money. Tell me where you got it or I'll burn it. Fine. You want to know so bad, I'll tell you. I got it from one of Marcus's homeboys, Spoon. He sells drugs. I know what he does. Tasha, you take Dion into your room and close the door behind you. Mom, can I just watch you hit him one time? Please? Now! Are you out of your mind? Are you selling drugs for him? No, I ain't selling drugs. Why are you tripping? Look, after Marcus got killed, Spoon said if I ever needed help, I should come to him. Now, unless I'm missing something, we need help. Yeah, you need help, all right. Give me your belt. 
Give you my belt. Ha! <laughs> you drizzed <tris> in! <laughs> Ma, you ain't with me since I was, what, 12 Boy, give me that damn belt! So it's like that? Yes. Cool. Go on, do what you got to do. I ain't gonna cry. Taking money from a drug dealer. How could you be so stupid, Andre? I thought I was... Okay, 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 okay. And hey, you got me. Girl, you better get back in there or you'll get some, too. Yeah, you'll get some, too. Get back in there. <laughs> Now, you pick up this money. We gonna go pay your friend a visit. Look, Ma, I'll take it back. But I'm going by myself. Ma, I told you I can do this by myself. Boy, right now I wouldn't trust you to go to the bathroom by yourself. Uh, yeah, is Spoon home? Who are you? Andre Mosley. <laughs> I'm Andre Mosley. I'm a friend of Spoon's. An acquaintance of Spoon's. <gasps> hey, Mama, who at the front door? Uh, I was here early today. Remember me? Andre? Boy, I don't remember who you are. So many fools pass through this door. Come on. <sighs> hey, what's happening? William, some people here to see you. You want a drink? I think I have some scotch. I guess not. Quite an apartment. <laughs> yeah. Keep telling William I don't need anything else, but he keeps bringing it home anyway. Most kids, they just take. Never think about giving. <laughs> guess I'm lucky mine turned out good. You know what I mean? No, I don't. William? Your friend's waiting. Acquaintance. Hey, hey, Ma, cool out. I'm not gonna say a word. This is on you. Right. Hey, yo, what's up, Spoon? Hey, what up, G? No, no G. Yeah. There's nothing G about him. Uh, <laughs> this here's my mom's. Yeah, yeah, I remember you from Marcus's funeral. What's up? Look, I didn't come here to talk to you. My son did, so anything you have to say, you say to him. I'm out of this. Well, anyway, Spoon, uh, I was coming by, man, because I just wanted to let you know. Give him the money. Ma, I'm doing it. Uh, we really appreciate you lending us these snaps, man, but we don't need it after all. So, uh, here's most of it. I get the rest as soon as I can. Damn, what happened to it, man? I tried to flush it down the toilet where it belongs. I know where that money comes from. What's up with this, Dre? Hey, Ma, Ma you have something to say, you say it to me. You just told me to send everything to him. Yeah, well, he doesn't have the good sense God gave him, so now you talk to me. Why are you fronting on me, lady? I gave Dre the money because he said you was broke. I wanted to help out. You know, Marcus was like my boy and all. No, Marcus was my boy. I'm sorry to tell you, lady, but Marcus from my set. Where I'm from, we takes care of our own. Hm. Are you crazy? I want you to stay away from him. I don't want you to give him any money. I don't want you to talk to him. I don't want you to look at him ever. Ain't no thing to me. You the one ain't got money to feed your sorry ass family. Yeah, uh, no, I don't. Uh, look, look, Ma, I think. But I would rather scrub toilets, dig ditches, do anything than take a penny from you. Let's go, Andre. Later, man. Yeah, man. Come on. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You better get the hell out of my house. job down at the co-op 
doesn't pay much and the hours will be long, but it'll put food on the table. I can't do this anymore, Andre. What's happening with us? You know, you used to be my little boy tearing through the house with your naughty little head and your Batman underoos. Yeah, things are different now, Ma. It ain't the same. But I liked it the old way. What's in this, anyhow? You know, I still don't remember. Uh, but I figured out you can eat it if you snap your head back when you swallow. <laughs> the energy. You know, Mom, I remember back in the day, we used to just chill. Going down to the beach and the park, all that. We used to have a bunch of fun. Yeah, that was fun. So what are we gonna do? I don't know. Get your jacket. What? Get your jacket. We're going to the park. <laughs> We're going to the park? Uh, uh, Ma, it's dark out there. You know we gonna get our ass kicked, right? <laughs> How you doing? Well, I must be doing a lot better than I thought, because I'm real popular with the young people this morning. Always happens around report card time. But is it report card time? Uh -huh. <laughs> Wish you the best. Of course, if you out here, it's the worst, isn't it? Yeah, it is the worst. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing out here? Oh, no, I, I, I'm, just, I'm just chilling. What did I tell you about that? When I ask you what you're doing, I don't want to hear nothing. I don't know, or I'm just chilling. Now, what are you doing out here? Nothing. I, I don't know, but I'm just chilling. Boy, don't you mess with me today. <laughs> to the shawl mom put five dollars on my leadway jacket and i gotta make sure ain't nobody wearing it you know connie she got her dress out of leadway and it has sweat stains on it <laughs> yes it did yo tosh moms want you to feed dion <clears throat> no she told you to feed him right now i'm telling you <laughs> you ain't nobody <laughs> just my immature brother what he is not fine oh she know what's up <laughs> yeah, i'll meet you in half an hour with hot dog on the stick what up, Black? What up, Shaw? Ain't nothing going on but the rent. But you ain't paying nothing here, so see ya. Hey, Muggsy. And I told you not to call me Muggsy. I can't help that. You mind me too much of Muggsy Bogues. Short, pesky, and bow-legged. <laughs> Ow, girl. Dang. 
Hey, boy, I see you got your report card. Man, give me that, man. Get up back to my business, What's dog. Big deal, man. You only fell one subject. Ooh, I'm telling mama. Hey, you ain't gonna tell moms nothing. Watch me. And you better stay away from my food. I'm not mama's gonna kick your butt. No, 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 no. See, that's where you're wrong. See, me and your moms were cool. See, in fact, we were so cool, I could have been your daddy if somebody had to beat me through the window. <laughs> Uh, I meant that in a good way, Mama Mosley. <laughs> hey, nice smock. Heard about your job as a checkout girl. I am not your mama. This is not a smock, and I am not a checkout girl. I am the assistant manager at the Uja Co-op. Well, my cousin was in there yesterday, said she saw you back in groceries. Oh, yes. So once in a while, when it gets busy, I occasionally help the cashier. Why am I wasting my time talking to you, boy? <laughs> Andre, I told you to feed Dion. As soon as he tell me what he wants, I feed him. Mama, guess how else Tasha, Andre messed up? up. He got his report card this morning. Uh, <laughs> he failed the subject. Let me see it. You know I'm hurt you, right? <laughs> now, now, Ma, uh, remember you, you, you kept me out on that day when I had the flu? <clears throat> Andre, this is ridiculous. Music, a D. P.E., a C. History, D+. Plus. English, B-. minus. Spanish, a fail. All right, give me a pound of that B minus. Hey, you know how I do it. Over, over. Rashad, shut up. How do you explain these grades? Go ahead, I want to hear it. Ma, you know school just ain't my thing. Well, guess what? School is my thing. And you're going to get good grades and go to college even if I have to kill you to get you there. Mom, what is so great about college? I mean, you went and now you're bagging groceries. Mom, is for you. Yeah, because I had to drop out of college to raise you knuckleheaded kids, and I do not bag groceries. Mama, would you take a message? It's Ray. Well, why didn't you give me the phone, child? <coughs> Hello, Ray. Look, will you... I'm fine. Look, will you come get this boy right now and talk some sense into him? Because if he brings home a report card like he did today, he's going to have to move out. Oh. Well, can he come to you? Good. OK, great. Thanks, Ray. All right. Now, who can drive your narrow behind to Inglewood to see Ray? Look, Mom, I'm tired of that old mentor stuff. But besides, today is my day to watch Dion. We got a little conversation to finish. <laughs> Who can drive you to Inglewood? My homeboy, Richard T. Davis. Who is that? RTD. Richard T. Davis. Yeah. Give me a pound on that. Pound. Oh, you give me a pound? <laughs> no. Well, I don't like you riding the bus. It's too dangerous. All right, cool. You know, I don't want to go talk about school anyway. All right. Make sure you ride in the front of the bus, OK? The front? Come on, I don't nobody ride the front. Hey, black people fought for that right, so do it. <laughs> but wait a minute, who's going to watch Dion? It's going to have to be you, baby. But my mom's supposed to meet Chanel. And I mean, besides, he's the one who messed up. Baby, your brother has special needs. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, so because I work hard and get good grades and don't need a mentor to keep me from destroying my life. My reward is that I have to stay home and watch Dion. And feed him, too, will you, baby? Bye-bye. Later. <laughs> I told you I was going to get you back. And he got you good, too, Muggsy. I go, there's a girl on our job, cause that's the Andre and I'm the Shad Rock. Uh, I'm chilling with a feeling for the 1990s. Hey, 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 I think I to watch this noise, man. That's the bomb, everywhere that I go, there's a girl yeah, on our job. Yeah, man, but this ain't my neighborhood, the... man, chill. Man, I ain't worried about that, man. You know who I am? And I'm the Shad Rock, not the fool off the block. Turn that back on, man. That's my jam. So. Turn it up, money. Yeah, I like that, man. That beat is fat. Yeah, it's fat. That's a badass box, brother. Where you get that? My, my mother bought it for me for my birthday. You know. Get one down to Circuit City, you know, they got to have one of the sales, you know. Yeah, let me see it, cuz. Come on, fool, I ain't gonna take it.
make it? Hey, yo, man, we gotta go, man. This is our stop. Who's talking to you, bitch? See, I just wanted to check it out, but now I'm ganking this bad boy. Hey, oh, man, man, hey, man, get up the phone, man. Hey, 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 come on, man. Let's go, man. We ain't messing with nobody. Girl, I'm messing with you. What you got to say now? Nothing. Oh, man. Wait a minute, I know this knucker. Yeah. You, uh... Andre, Andre Mosley. Marcus' brother, right? Yeah, yeah. Me and Marcus used to be cool back in the day. He's all right, Snow. Straight up. Look, I see you around here again. I don't care who your brother is. I'm a papa cap in your ass. <laughs> hey, yo, boy. It's us, man. Come on. Jeez. I thought you missed your stop. Oh, no, that's all right. You know, I'm just gonna ride the bus for a while. I'll be with you in a second. I just want to finish this thought. I'm working on a speech I got to give at a medical conference tonight. Damn, you came up in the riots. <laughs> hey, why you playing all this white music? Hey. Andre, would you turn that down, please? <laughs> Sit down. So, uh, you like my stereo? Yeah, it's all right. You like my house? Yeah, it's pretty fat. But you know, I trick it out. Have all leather furniture, a much bigger TV set, and uh, better pictures on the walls. Mm. Well, I hate to be the one to break this to you, Andre, but you'll never have those things if you don't straighten up and fly right, brother. <sighs> Look, you gotta get your butt into college, and you'll never get in there with the sorry kind of grades you're getting now. What's wrong with my pictures? Look, man, I don't need to go to no college. Ice Cube didn't go to college. All right, he made it, but a lot of others didn't. Yeah, well, what about Flavor Flay, Sean Kemp, and all of the Jacksons? Look, Andre, I know you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Nicole, yeah. come in. Did you find everything? Oh, yes, I did. This is all the research material that you requested. Wonderful. You're a lifesaver. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Nicole, Andre, Andre, Nicole. Uh, Nicole, I have some files I need you to take back to the office. I'll be right back. So, how do you know Dr. McHenry? Oh, he's my mentor. I work for him after school. I'm planning to be a doctor myself. Pediatrics. So you live around here? Yeah, I got a big old house right across the street. <laughs> no, where are you really from? Over on 110. Oh, yeah, I've been over there. Girl, you wouldn't know nothing about that. Do you know Akeem Wright? Yeah, he stayed around away from me. Yeah, that's my cousin. For real? Akeem? <laughs> that boy is crazy. Ain't he though? Yeah. <laughs> but that's why he's my favorite cousin. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. So where you from? Ladera Heights. Oh, Ladera Heights, Miss Ladera. <laughs> Ooh. So uh, you stand up in there with the rich folks. Oh, no, it ain't all that. Why do you need a mentor? Are you a gangbanger or something? Oh, hell no. Nah. As a matter of fact, uh, we were just talking about some college. Oh, yeah, he knows a lot about that. Next year, he's writing me a recommendation to Princeton. Princeton, yeah, I'm down with that set. You see, I'm going to be up in there myself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. Here you go, Nicole. Oh. Okay, doctor. Yeah. Nice meeting you, Andre. Yeah. Hey, yo, Ray, how do I get into Princeton, man? You can start. <laughs> you can start by getting a grade higher than a D. And what got you so interested in Princeton? Yo, wherever she's going, I want to be. Oh. Baby had booty for days. <laughs> Yo, yo, who is she? The daughter of some very dear friends of mine. Oh, cool. Then you can hook me up with our little digits. 
Digits? Her phone number. Uh, Andre, I don't think that would be such a good idea. I do. I mean, baby was on my jock. Believe me, I know these things, you know? Look, I've known her parents for a lot of years. So what's the matter? Oh, what, you don't think I'm good enough for your friend's daughter? I didn't say that. Then hook me up with the number. Look, Andre, yeah, yeah, I just... Yeah, 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 just like I thought. Andre! Andre! Boys, you supposed to have my back. I oughta kick your ass. Man, what was I supposed to do, man? Homie, I oughta get. Besides, man, my mom woulda killed me if I let him kill me. <laughs> Anyhow, man, I gave you the signal to run, man, but you didn't run. What signal? When I went out the window. Man, there wasn't no signal. Man, you're a little chump. So what happened? I handled myself. <laughs> man, I gotta tell you, you broke up at that window quick. <laughs> I had to, man. Old boy was tripping, man. I figured saving one is better than none. <laughs> What's up, Muggsy? Nothing, Thugsy. But yo, anyway, I met this fly little honey dip over at Ray's crib. Word? Yeah. Oh, man, I know I should have stayed, man. You push up on her? You better believe it. Honey dip was swinging for my jock strap. Swinging for jockey, just jockey. Uh, yeah. What about your jock strap? Oh, I was about to put it in the laundry. <laughs> you see, Shaw wanted to know. Is it just me, or does everything you say come out sounding like a lie? Uh, Ma, I think it's just you. <laughs> Rashad? I suppose your presence here means you're coming to church with us. Uh, you know, Mama Mosley, I'd really love to, but I already went to that. Yes, it was great. They had a few new hymns. Boy, you wouldn't know a hymn if God himself hummed it for you. <laughs> Peace out, man. Andre, fasten this on for me, please. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, no, you are not wearing sneakers to church. Ma, these are my best kicks. Baby, from your head to your cuffs, you look like Denzel, and then it's hammer time. <laughs> nah, my hammer time is played out. <laughs> so are your shoes. <laughs> so change them. Ow! Oh, I'm sorry, Ma, here you go. Hey, Ma, I think you need to clip that kitchen back there, because it's rough. <laughs> I, I get it. Hello? Oh, um, what you want, Ray? Uh-huh. Oh, serious? She is? Yeah, 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 I'm down. Cool, now she's gonna be there, right? Yeah, all right, I'll be right over. All right, bye. Hey, Ma, Ray wants me to go to church with him, so I'm gonna have to leave now. Andre, your sister is singing in the choir today. She needs your support. I don't want him there. <laughs> See? Besides, after church, me and Ray gonna talk about me going to Princeton. With your grades, that'll be a short conversation. <laughs> Come on, Ma, can I go? Oh, Andre, I don't know. I don't want you riding the bus. Why not? I went down there yesterday and I used the bus. I mean, it was all right. And look, Ma, gang bangers, they've been drinking 40s all night. They too hung over to mess with anybody. <laughs> Why are you so anxious to go to church with Ray? I know it doesn't have anything to do with talking about Princeton. There's a girl. Tasha, would you shut up, okay? Oh. What girl? Nobody. All right, just the little girl who worked with Ray. Come on, Ma, please, can I go? I mean, her parents are gonna be there and everything. Come on, Ma, please, please, let me go. Change those shoes. I don't want you embarrassing me in somebody else's church. Thank you, Ma. I love you, I love you, you love me. Yeah, I love yeah, yeah, go on, boy. I love you too, Tasha. <laughs> If we don't leave, we're gonna miss the start of service. Look, let's just give him a few more minutes, okay? 
Well, why don't you guys just go ahead? I'll wait for him. Young lady, please. There he is. Out here, Ray. Andre? Oh, my God, what happened? Come inside. Man, it ain't no big deal, I'm all right. Well, come in and let me take a look. Damn, Ray, I told you I was all right. Andre, what happened? Oh, ain't nothing. Just some trick-ass punk jacked me for my gym shoes on the way over here. Oh, these must be your parents. Hey, how y'all doing? I'm Andre. Andre, sit down. Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, Ray, maybe we ought to be going. We've already missed the start of service. Oh, uh, I understand, James. Go on ahead. Um, I'm going to stay with Andre. No, you're not. But Mommy's hurt. Your mother said no. Now, come on. Feel better, okay? Oh, yeah, oh, you know I'm gonna be all right. I'll see you later. No, you won't. <laughs> uh, Mom, Ray already fixed me up. Well, now it's my turn. I did take care of him, Joan. Yeah, Ma, he's a doctor. Well, I'm a mother. Oh, come on, Ma, that hurts. That's what you get. Ma, it's not like I beat myself up. You lied to me, Andre. I'm fine, don't worry. Nothing ever happens on the bus. And why would you walk out of here in those sneakers anyway? You know that's just asking for trouble. Ma, that guy would have jacked me if I had on flip-flops. <laughs> oh, come on, Ma. Uh, Mama, you missed the spot right there. Would you go somewhere, girl? Hey. Uh, look. I better get going. Ray, thanks. I'm sorry you had to miss church. No problem. The Baptists go all day. <laughs> Look, Joan, I had no idea the bus ride was so dangerous. Uh, it's not your fault, Ray. Well, all the same, I apologize. Oh, bye. See you, Andre. Tasha. Later, man. Will you see Ray to the door? Next time you need to ride the bus, you better take... Me and my girls with you. You better go. Ooh. Shoot. Look at what that thug did to my baby's beautiful face. Hey, I'm sorry, Ma. Look, I'll be more careful next time. Next time? No, there will be no next time. You are not riding that bus anymore. Mom, but I really like this girl. I'm sorry, Andre. You're just going to have to find yourself a nice young lady who lives around here. Oh, come on, Ma. I ain't no girls around here. End of discussion. You are not riding that bus ever. Of course I like you. Why else would I have paid your psycho cousin $5 for your number? So, uh, what your parents think of me? What? But I ain't no gangbanger. That guy who jacked me was a gangbanger. Yeah. So how was church? Yeah, I know it was happening, cause you were wearing that dress. <laughs> yeah. Cute. I ain't cute, girl. I'm hard, straight rough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's like, like your parents don't want you to see me. And my moms don't want me to see you. I mean, how we gonna do this? None of your wannabe gangster mess. 
So if you want to steal some lousy cake, mix up some plastic forks, go right ahead. Man, she tripped. Man, what you wrong? Get your Man, you make cake. Man, you cake. I don't love you. Get out of here. I don't, I don't you, love you. See you, bro. Hey, man, hook it back man, up. Anyway, hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, Can you spot me on back there? Yeah, yeah. 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 sleep either. I was just laying there, you know, just thinking about you. <laughs> hey, but I did have this dream, though. I was on a bus coming down to see you, right? And all of a sudden, I felt this big old gun in my ribs. So I turned around, and it was your mom's. <laughs> Yo, for real, she had this big old gold tooth, a do-rag, and some high heels on. Yo, she was looking straight loco. <laughs> hey, but uh, on the real, when we gonna hook up? Hey, uh, look, I, I gotta go. Yeah, my nosy little sister is standing right here. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. All right, bye. Don't let me interrupt your begging. What, girl, I ain't got the beg. You better recognize. Please, I heard you on the phone last night. Oh, baby, you so fine. I want to get with you. <laughs> you know that bougie girl ain't going to give you none. Hey, she is not bougie, okay? So how you going to see her anyhow? You know if you take that bus again, you going to get beat down. <laughs> Ain't nobody gonna beat me down. Boy, get your butt down. Oh, yes, ma'am. Where's Dion? Did you feed him and dress him like I asked you to? Yeah, I fed him, and he's in the room getting dressed right now. Oh, he is, is he? Ma, he's ready to start dressing himself. Well, thank you for that clinical evaluation, Dr. Dre. Hey, ain't no problem. <laughs> Don't have time for this. I got to get to work. Mama, Chanel and I are staying after school today for track meet. Is that okay? Yeah, baby, I wish it were, but I'm working till 7. I need you to pick Dion up right after school and take him to his therapy session at 6. Mama! Oh, man, this boy is fast. Come on, bring your bush feel looking butt on in here, boy. Mama, I want to go to track meet. Clean underwear, Andre. I know, Mom. Both of you. It's against banning, and everybody's gonna be there. Oh, baby, you have to tell me about these things in advance. Now, remember to feed Dion right when you get him home from school, and don't forget he gets a half-hour cuddle time. Man, I don't want to cuddle him. Why do I always get stuck with Dion? Why can't Andre do it? Come on, baby, help Mama, please. And relax your face. It's so pretty when it's not all scrunched up like that. All right. No, 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 no. This is a health food market. We don't sell fat back. No, I don't think fat back is healthy. Yes, I am black. Joan, I'm waiting here. Why don't you come down and see what we have, okay? Thank you. I'm sorry, Rod. Look, I told you I'm having cash flow problems. I can't cut you a check today. Oh, man. Um, wow. Look, my boss said if you can't pay me, I, I got to take back the merchandise. Rod. Man. I mean, the 10 grain muffins. Excuse me. Cakes. Excuse me, Marshall. Marshall. What? What do you need? I just came by to do my shopping, baby. Well, if I catch you eating off the shelves again, it's going to be me and you. Go hang out near the air freshener. <laughs> Rod, we're friends, right? We're 
with me. Leave the merchandise, let me sell it, make some money, and have a check for you on Friday, okay? Joan, I'm gonna get fired, you know. No, you won't. Hey, you're the only white boy they have that's not afraid to deliver down here. Joan, can I get some help over here, maybe today? Mayo, I swear, I can't get Bobby to sit still for five minutes to go over the books. We don't have enough money in the bank to pay our bills. Joan! What am I supposed to do? Yes! Well, for starters, you should make sure there's enough money to pay my damn check, or y'all gonna see a slavey boat up in here. Oh. What's going on? There's not enough money to cover our checks? No one said that, Lucille. Look, because I got bills to pay, and if I don't have my money on Friday, I'm gonna have one funky attitude. Well, by all means, we wouldn't want that. Well, look, I'm warning you right now. Don't be playing my damn money now. I'm too old and too tired to be messing around with this man. Good morning, Rainbow Coalition. Oh, please. Bobby, could I speak with you, please? Sure, Joe. I need to see my messages, though. Here they are. Bobby, we need to talk. Yes! Ha-ha! <laughs> Channel 11 News, everybody. I think they're going to do a live spot on us this afternoon. That explains the new dashiki. Yeah, but if I don't get my paycheck on Friday, I'm going to be wearing that bad boy. <laughs> hey! Hey! What's wrong with you? I ain't no damn You're gone. Get away from here. Could I get some compensation for my services? I better I'll compensate your ass. You don't get out of here. Hey, Lucille, check this out, baby. Could I get the deposit money on these bottles, please? Can't you read? Five cents deposit only in Massachusetts, Vermont, and Maine. <laughs> there is nothing we can do for you, Marshall. I'm sorry. Yo, Bobby. What's up, Jay? Your people don't want to take my bottles, man. Come on, why don't you give him five cents for each yeah. one of his bottles, please? Fine. Yeah. Bobby, we can't. Marshall, why don't you go in the back and sweep up, and then I'll fix you up some sandwiches, brother. Thank you, my brother. I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man, I ain't trying to get nothing free. You know what I'm saying, man? I, I work for mine. At least you get paid. <laughs> Very humanitarian of you, Bobby. You just gave away money we owe five times over. Now, please take a look at I these numbers. don't have time now, Joan. I just got off the phone with Channel 11. They are going to do that spot this afternoon. Part of this series on the two-year anniversary of the rebellion. I don't have time. Rebellion? Shoot. What went on here two years ago was a damn riot. No, 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 no. You see, Mayo, when people resist a racist and oppressive power structure, it's a rebellion. Yeah, but when the damn people burn down my damn grocery store, it's a damn riot. Find yourself, my brother. Now, maybe if you were nice to the people, Mayo, they wouldn't have burnt down your store. I am nice. Could I have my sandwich now? You can have a knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, Isaiah, hi. How are you? My money, Joan. Look, your aisles are stocked with my goods, and you promised I'd have my check two days ago. Yes, and I intended to write that check two days ago, but I've been having... A wrong answer, lady. Jevin say total. Isaiah, wait one minute. I'll be gone in two. Bobby? What? See for yourself. That's what happens when we don't pay people. Joan, I don't have time to deal with that right now. Look, you gotta play hardball with him. Tell him that as black people, we've got to stick together in times of economic crisis. Oh, please, Bobby. If you believe that bull, you tell him. Joan, look, you're my assistant manager. Deal with it. Don't let him push you around. Isaiah, can we talk about this? There must be some sort of arrangement we can reach. Yeah, well, when you reach for a check, then we'll talk. As black people, we have to stick together in times of economic crisis. As black people? You know, it's black people like you that are about to drive me out of business. I'm struggling myself, Joan, so save it. You save that crap for somebody who doesn't know any better. Isaiah, my brother, is there a problem? Yes, there is a problem. See, your girl here... His girl? ...promised that I'd have my money two days ago, and she still won't pay up. And on top of that, she's trying to run some sorry old black empowerment His rap. girl? Joan, excuse us for a moment, please. Isaiah, look, brother, I'm sorry. Joan is new, and evidently she's still mastering proper management technique. Well, why did you hire her if she doesn't know how to do her job? I didn't say that. It's that she probably just made a mistake. Now I have everything cleared up by Friday. Can I pay you then? Yeah, I suppose. Thank you, brother. Dejen eso. Vámonos. Now jump. I know what that looked like. 
I don't know how to do my damn job. Bobby, you don't pay me enough to put up with this. Joan, I'm sorry. Won't happen again. But he is giving us until Friday, am I right? Fine, Bobby. But I don't like being played for a fool. A fool? Sister, you are a hero. A hero to the cause. Joan of South Central. God. Dion, will you cut that out? I told you to stop it. Here, play with this. I gotta finish my report. Dion! What's wrong with you, Dang! Look, stop it. I'm going to hurt you. I'm not playing. Hey, I'm Tosh, what's wrong with him? I don't know. He's like he's crazy again. What am I supposed to do? I don't know. Why don't you try that uh, cuddle time stuff with him? I'm not cuddling him. Well, that's all I got. I'm out. <laughs> Where are you going? Hey, it's my cuddle time. Peace. Just be still so I can cuddle you. Ramos? Come on in. Hello, Adriana. He Hello, Jesse. <laughs> I'll be with you in a few minutes, Reverend. <clears throat> oh, I'll be with you in one second. The patient is now dead. <laughs> Andre! Oh, wh what are you doing here? Oh, I thought I'd just roll over, you know, to see what's up. <clears throat> well, I'm working. That's what's up. How did you get down here? I know you didn't take the bus, did you? Oh, no, no, no. Don't even worry about that. Didn't know pop off? Man, what they have you doing up in here? Um, Andre, uh-uh, stop. Don't, please. Oh, what, you ain't happy to see me? Huh? You ain't happy to see um, you, girl? Yeah, no, well, I am. But what if Dr. McHenry comes out? He knows my parents hate you. Oh, no, why I gotta be like that? Hey, besides, me and Ray cool like that. That's my man. But still, I'm supposed to be working. I don't want to get fired. Uh, girl, you are just too fine to get fired. As a matter of fact, that's why Ray hired you in the first place. So you are good for business. Hey, you see that preacher over there? He ain't sick. He's just faking so he can come check you out. Ain't that right, preacher? Peek a boo, look at him. <laughs> look, you gotta go. Uh, hey, Nicole, when we gonna hook up? You know, on the real. Andre. Hey, you just tell me and I'll be out. <sighs> Friday night. Oh, come on, Friday night is... <laughs> that should be enough to hold you till then. Now beat it. Dang, baby. I, I don't know if I can wait till Friday now, because it's... <laughs> oh, what's up, Mama Nicole? How you doing? Remember me? Uh, we met over at Ray's place. Yes, uh, I recall. <clears throat> Mom, you're early. Andre I was just coming over here so was... Ray could check out this thing right here. It is hitting up real fine. Thanks for asking, bye. <laughs> See, in the two years since we arose from the ashes of the rebellion, our roots in this community have grown strong and very deep. The tree we call Ujima is now bearing fruit, the sweet fruit of economic empowerment. He can really shovel it, can't he? Can you Bobby? explain exactly Shoot, how he can sell pig feet this. to a Muslim. <laughs> Toss me a towel, will you, Mayo? I am sweating like nobody's business. Which entitled them to ownership of Thanks. Our hope is Keep it. In what specific ways has your co-op benefited members of this community? Let me just give you a few examples. Take this gentleman. This is Marshall. Is he an employee? I'm an independent contractor. <laughs> Actually, Marshall is a member of the forgotten transient underclass we employ from time to time. You see, the great thing about Ujima is that it serves as a resource for people like Marshall who are down on their luck. Take, for example, Joan Mosley. Now, just a few weeks ago, Joan was in here shopping and could barely afford to pay for groceries. She was unemployed, broke, and just a day away from welfare. Now our sister is part of the Ujima family, bagging groceries instead of begging for them. 
There you have it, the Ujima Co-op, a bright ray of hope in a community struggling to rebuild. Janine Taylor reporting live from South Central Los Angeles. I ain't seen nobody beat down like that since Rodney King. <laughs> Shut up, Mayo. The woman was just humiliated on live TV with her hair looking like that. <laughs> Give her five minutes. Yeah, there's such a positive vibe in this place. Bobby! Bobby! Joan, can we talk later, please? Now, Bobby. <laughs> I'll be right back, Janine. What is it, Joan? I'm about a half a minute away from a follow-up segment. I'm a half a minute away from walking out that door. How could you do that to me? Do what? Hold me up to ridicule on live TV, telling the world I was out of work, broke, almost on welfare. And which part of that isn't true, Joan? That's not the point. Well, what is the point, sister? Are you ashamed of your life? Oh, give me a break, Bobby. Now, I balance books, haul boxes, bag groceries, but being made a fool of is not part of my job description. I demand respect. I got news for you, sister. This is not about you, and it's not about me. It's about our co-op. Oh, really? Then why wasn't our co-op wearing that nice new dashiki? Huh? Look, I do what I have to do to keep this place running. Now, I did not hold you up to ridicule. I held you up as an inspiration. Now, a lot of brothers and sisters just saw you on TV, and they're going to identify with you. And tomorrow, they're going to come down here and shop and perhaps be a part of this whole thing. Now, if you know a better way to accomplish that, then I'd like to hear it. Fine. Fine. OK, that's the way you want to run your business, fine. But the least you could have done, the least you could have done was to give me a minute to run a damn brush through my hair. <laughs> Hi, Dion. My mom's working, so I brought him over. Here. <laughs> and don't start acting crazy again. So how long is it going to be? 45 minutes. Fine. I'll be doing my homework. Why don't you come in a minute? What for? I think we should talk. Dion, I've got some new toys in the other room. Why don't you go in there and play? Tasha, have a seat. Shouldn't you be with him? He's all right. So you had a rough afternoon with him? Yeah. Want to tell me about it? He's just acting crazy, you know, throwing things, yelling and hitting me. I know, it's very frustrating to deal with him when he's like that. <laughs> At least you get paid by the county. And my mom gets a check every month. But I don't get nothing for minding him. So why do you do it? Who else is going to do it? She's working, and Andre's so trifling, he can't even look after the time. You seem angry about it. Look, I got homework to do. Well, are you angry with Dion? I didn't say that. Are you? He's just a sorry old crack baby. It ain't his fault. Whose fault is it? Whose fault is what? The fact that you're so angry. <laughs> Yours for asking all these dumb questions. Do you want to leave? I said that five minutes ago. Man, I don't even know why I'm in here. And I don't even know why I have to do all the rest of the stuff for him either. Pick him up, feed him, bring him home, wash him, play with him, do cuddle time, bring him to the doctor. Now, you said yourself there's no one else to do all that. Then she shouldn't have got him in the first place. I mean, it ain't fair. She never asked me. She just brought him home one day. Just brought his stupid, no-talking foster ass home. So why do you think she took him in? Oh, I know why. Tell me. Because of Marcus being killed. <laughs> yeah, that's right. She just wanted another boy in the house. And I know it's true, because she babies him just like she did Marcus, and just like she does Andre, too. And they ain't even the real babies of the family. Where did she come up with cuddle time, anyhow? It must be a crap baby thing. She never did it with me. Yeah. Hey, it's me. 
me. Can I come in? Yeah. Girl, I thought I told you to clean this room up last Saturday. I did. This mess is all since then. Good Lord, Tasha. Ouch! What did I sit on? My stapler. <sighs> so how was your day? Not so good. Yours? Same. Thank you for taking care of Dion for me. How does therapy go? Hey, what's up, black people? Hey. Boy, what are you so happy about? It's all good in the hood, right, D? <laughs> Peace. I'm sad, Mom. You want to talk about it? I'm sorry you had a bad day, baby. I love you, Tosh. Not even gray anymore, they're white. Damn kids. Andre! Yeah, you do it, baby. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, look, I'll call you back, all right? Hey, what's up, Moss? Boy, who did you call at the crack of dawn on my phone? Oh, it was just a little friend. Well, is your friend gonna pay my phone bill? I don't know. It's $15 over this month. And where's Dion? Instead of running your mouth, you should be fixing his breakfast. Well, I already told him to go get started. <gasps> Look at this. You just gave me another one, boy. Oh, Dion, no! Andre! Oh! Huh? Clean up this mess. What? I didn't...
didn't do it. You were really not worth 36 hours of labor pains. Clean it up. I have to get my own place. Oh, I can't wait for you to get your own place either. Then maybe I'll come over to your house and run up your phone bill. And don't think you're not paying that $15. And whose 310 number is this anyway that's on my phone bill about 50 times? Oh, that's just a friend from school. You know, we just be talking about homework and stuff. Homework. Then why have you failed two tests in a row? Three. Hey, shut up. Break. And sing us a different song, man. That saved a red like you. Hey, would you get on? Go. Hey, 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 hey. Leave your sister alone. She's got choir practice today. Our little Aretha got the solo this week, huh? That's why you idiot. Would you, would you, would you so? Oh, she's so sick. Okay. Uh, Andre, you need to get Dion to school right now. And remember, you have to pick him up today, too. Uh-uh, uh-uh, no, it's her turn to pick him up today. I just told you, your sister has practice. Dang, I do everything around here. Oops. Oh, you poor baby. <sighs> now, pour him a quick bowl of cereal and make sure you get out of here in the next five minutes or he'll be late. Let's go. Come on, Tosh. Get on somewhere, man. Redial. Ah. Hey, Nicole. Yeah, what's up, baby? Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, me. Hey, so, uh, like I was saying, when we gonna hook up, you know? Me, you, your bed. <laughs> oh, come on, don't be saying that, because every time you do, and I say I'm on my way over, all of a sudden your parents are home. Later today? All right, yeah, cool, cool, cool. I'm gonna come over right after school. Hey, uh, mm, yeah. <laughs> I know you're gonna look good for me, right? Yeah, I got my little black Calvin's on. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Dion, no, 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 no. Oh, man. Messing up, boy. Oh, ah. Oh. Oh, it's all good, you know? No, no, there's that. What? What's, um, what's wrong? You ain't getting all scared on me, are you? Oh, no, no, I'm not scared. I want to do this. <sighs> but, what? but I need to know, I need to know if you do. Me? Shoot. Baby. Uh, ta -da! <laughs> I got the hookup. We can do this all the way to Friday on the real. Mm-mm. <laughs> Listen, that's not what I meant. Look, before we go any further, I need to know how you feel about me. Yo. Do you love me? Well, you know I think you look fly. Why else would I be in there trying to get with you, you know? No, no, wait, wait. I, I didn't ask to hear no ghetto macking. I know what this is. Man, you faking a funk. Man, you ain't nothing but a big tease. I, I am not a tease. Andre. Yeah, yeah. Andre, I love you. And I need to know if you love me before before I can go any further. I don't know about all this uh, soap opera madness. Forget this. Look, you need to take those expired condoms and get up out of my house. Whoa, 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 okay, okay, wait, Nicole, Nicole, Nicole. Okay, okay, we can talk. No, no, no. Now you want to talk? Now the sex is on the line. Whoa. Yeah. What? No, no, it doesn't work that way. Damn, Nicole, what you want from I me? I want you to go home until you know how to be honest. All this is on pause. Uh-uh, the window. What? I don't want my neighbors to see you and tell my mother. Yeah. Are we still hooking up at the Highlight Friday? Um, maybe. I don't know, I have to think about it. Fine. But I want you to know one thing. This window business got to cease. And that's honest. Do it, Paul. Hey, you better 
dear Nicole. I'm like sitting that. here on the bus he thinking about what just went down. <laughs> Hey, that girl got you doing our work. Did you stay out my business? So what did just went down? You hit them draws? <laughs> Look, I say out of my business, shot right that. Oh, you didn't get done. Shut you shut didn't up. get done. You ain't get done either. <laughs> oh. oh, snap. Oh, that's my mom's. <laughs> yeah, she probably know you didn't get none either. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. I forgot to pick up Dion. Dang, uh, look, uh, uh, uh if she asked her, tell her I was with you. You are with me. No, not now. We're talking about all afternoon when I was with Nicole. Begging and pleading and still didn't get none. <laughs> Shut up, man. You wouldn't know nothing about that. See, you know, me and uh, Nicole, we got a different kind of relationship oh, and all that. Oh, there you go. Me and Nicole got a different kind of relationship. You know, man, Dre, if I was with Nicole, I'd been all up on the biz booty. You know what I'm oh, saying? Oh, boy, you couldn't handle that booty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> boy, they don't call me Shad Rock for nothing. See, he was a young whippersnapper, man. See, you don't know nothing about loving a woman. Dre. As the famous poet Snoop Doggy Dog once said, and I quote, we don't love them hoes. <laughs> That's why they don't love you. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Shad Rock gets plenty of honeys. OK, Shad Rock. No, I'm serious. I'm serious, man. Like this. See that hood rap right there? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. But she keep looking. Hey, come on, Shad. No, I'm serious, man. No, no, no. Watch this. Watch this. Hey, fool, what's up, punk? What's happening, fool? Hey, come on, come on, shot, chill, man. Right, man. Oh, you just gonna diss me like that and try to step to my girl right in front of me, huh? Yeah, I guess she know a good thing when she see one. Man, you was a little mark, man. You probably from the valley. Come on, man, let's go, dog. Mm -hmm. Now, hold up, valley boy, where you going? You can't leave now. You need a ghetto pass to get off here, poppy. Why don't you go ahead and stall all that noise out? Yeah, doc, look, just don't start nothing, okay? Just... Don't you just shut your winking ass up? Uh... Like I was saying, where's your ghetto pass? It's right here. Whoa! Uh, yeah, yeah, Doc, what you got to say now? <laughs> yeah, you better get your winking ass out of here before you need a Doc. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you the man, you the man. Yeah. Well, that's why I hate bringing you somewhere. You always get me in trouble. <laughs> damn, Trey, man, you see the buses raise up off us? Yeah, how long you been here? <sighs> Ever since I got jacked that last time. Look, man, I ain't going out like that no more. Hey, man, where you get it from? It's my mom's. She keeps it locked up in her closet. Mom? Mama Mosley packing like dirty Harry? <laughs> man, hey, man, man, look, man, don't be broadcasting it to everybody. Look, she don't know I know about it. So keep your big mouth shut. Hey, man, relax. You're a man now. Let me see. No, no, I mean, look, man, this ain't no water gun shot, and it ain't no joke. Damn, man. I was scared, man. No, 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 Drake. No, 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 man, the busters were scared, man. You see how them punks raised up off us? Drake, man, we got juice now, man. We got juice. She's in there, man. Dang, Muggsy can blow. Yeah, yeah, look, she all right. But I need you to distract her so uh, I can put this Yeah, cool, up. man. Oh, you know, I got your back, man. Boy, where you been? None of your business, shorty. You know you were supposed to pick up Dion from school, and Mama had to pick him up on her way from work. Now, I'm late for choir practice because uh, of you. Tasha, you have a lovely voice. Why don't we go in the kitchen and chat about choir rehearsal? Why don't you chat your butt out of here? Just go away, man. Dang. Uh... I think I'm gonna go in the kitchen and find me something to fix a big old sandwich with. <laughs> go on. Ain't no food in there. Uh, I, I know y'all got some hamburger meat up in here. Yeah, uh -huh. maybe a hamburger. Well, if you can find some, fix me one too. Uh, hey, Muggsy. I heard you got a part-time job singing back up for Hammer. Hammer? <laughs> Pumps in your I ain't box. no sellout. <laughs> Ready to go? Yep. Oh, what were you 
you doing in my room? Oh, I was looking for you. No, you wasn't. I told you Mama was picking up Dion. Well, Tasha, you know, I didn't hear you say that. Yes, you did. Why are you lying? And why you look like a snapdragon? <laughs> snapdragon. Okay, quiet. Now, where were you? <clears throat> Dion was waiting for you outside his school by himself for half an hour. Oh, my bad. My, I forgot. I'm sorry. Andre, that's not good enough. Where were you? I was just kicking it with Rashad. Uh, yeah, Mama, mostly, uh, we was doing homework. Mama, I'm late for Andre, practice. Andre, I Come beat on. you three times. Where is that thing? Uh, it's, it's in my book bag. You see, uh, I, I left it on vibrate. Andre, the only reason I gave you that thing is so that I could reach you when I need to. Mom, the teacher heard it go off, and she told me to put it up. Mama, please. I thought it was in your backpack. Look, Ma, I forgot that I put it back on. Dang, won't you just bleed? Don't you dang me, boy. And don't you dare try to put this back on me. Now, you have been lying left and right. I know something is up with you. What is going on? Ah, uh, nothing. What is it, Andre? Uh, what uh, is going on practice. with you? They're going to take the solo away from me. All right, Andre. Until you can get it together and show some responsibility in this family, you're grounded. Wait, wait, wait. Grounded? Mom, wait. For how long? Until I say otherwise. What about the high life on Friday? What about it? Oh, come on, Mama Mosley. It's got to be there Friday. I'm, I'm MCing. I mean, you can't. We're partners. Rashad, if you don't watch it, I'm going to call your mama and you'll be grounded, too. I'm going to miss you, bro. What? what? Now, get to your chores. And as a matter of fact, do Tasha's, too. Thank you. Put these groceries away and feed Dion. Do you hear? Do you hear me? Yeah. Everybody in the neighborhood can hear you. What you say? Uh, nothing. I was just... Come on, man. Here's your damn tofu burgers. No calories, no fat, no taste. No reason to eat the damn things. Enjoy. <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on, fuckadelics. You better take your condo kit outside. Yo, check this out, Mel. I got orders from Bobby to put this over there so that we can build us a stage, you know what I'm saying? A stage? Don't be bringing your homeless routine inside here. Nah, man. This is for some kids so they can come in here and do their rap thing. Bobby said it's gonna get them up off the street, you know. Why, you two need more room? Marshall, lean that there and take those magazines out of the rack. We're gonna put the stage right Bobby, in Bobby, Bobby, what's this I hear about you bringing a bunch of damn hippie hoppers into my deli? <laughs> That's right, Mayo. Come Friday evening, this place is gonna be packed wall to wall with young people. See, that's what we need in here, Mayo, that youthful vibe. And you, of all people, should appreciate that. What are you, uh, pushing 70? Ain't nobody <laughs> laughing, Bobby. 70? <laughs> <laughs> Lighten up, my brother. Look, you'll feel real good Friday evening when you are serving those young people some cold drinks. Forget it. I got tickets to see Millie Jackson on Friday. Find yourself another fool. Uh, uh, Joan. Joan, I, I, I need you to work here Friday night. No, Bobby. Mayo, look. Mayo, this is our chance to make a difference in our community. This is my chance to make a difference in my sex life. But my woman here is Millie. She gets ideas. Bad ideas. I'll give you an extra $20. Ha! <laughs> I'll be here. <laughs> what are you going to tell your wife? My wife? I said I was taking my woman. Two different things, Bobby. Two different things. <laughs> hey, what's up, Mom? What am I gonna do with you? You're supposed to come get these groceries 20 minutes ago. I do not want Dion waiting out on that street again. Oh, come on, it's okay. I got plenty of time to go pick that boy up. And what do you do hanging out with Rashad? You're grounded. Hey, Mo Mosley, I ain't with him. I'm here on high life business. I got my life together. Hey, Bobby. I'm serious, Andre. When I tell you to do something, I expect you to do it. But, Mom, the only thing no I was... No buts. Either you start getting it, or you're gonna be on punishment the rest of your life. All right, I get it. But can we talk about this high life thing? I mean, I gotta be here Friday night for the big kickoff. No, what you got to do is go pick up Dion, go home, and start dinner. And don't put hot sauce in everything. Uh, Andre. Huh? Can I talk to you a second? Ma, he's your boss. Hey, what's up? I 
Just a little concern. I heard you guys had an incident on the bus the other day. What happened? <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, Bobby, but uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Uh, Mama Mosley don't even allow him on the bus no more. <laughs> Ever since he got his ass kicked. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Maybe what I heard was wrong. But I know how it is out there. A little beef escalates. Something big. Okay, and everybody's carrying guns these days, and I wouldn't want y'all to get into that. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, yeah, Bobby. Yeah, Bob, we hear what you yeah, yeah, we know what's right. up, Bobby. Yeah. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, listen. I know it's hard for y'all to talk to your parents sometimes. I want you young brothers to know that you can come to talk to me about whatever. I'm always here for you. We got to keep the black man strong in our community. We're becoming an endangered species. Yeah, and we don't want you to go out like the buffaloes, my brothers. I'm telling you, Drake, he knows about the gap. What are you talking about, Rashad? Bobby ain't say nothing about it. Man, you know those militant fools never say what they mean. He was speaking in code. Man. Talking all that stuff about, uh, I'm here for you, brothers. Uh, come see me anytime. Man, bottom line translations, I'm on your ass. <laughs> Look, man, that's where you're wrong. Man, Bobby too busy selling goat cheese and tofu to know what's up. I mean, besides, even if he did know, what he gonna do? Tell your moms. Oh, wait a minute. I know Bobby wouldn't go out like that. Or would he? Hell yeah! But then later for him, man. He don't know what I'm going through. I'm just trying to see my girl. He can go talk to those fools who be jacking people on a bus. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What the hell he know? Yeah, back in his day, they used to get their scrap on. And now they just pull out that heat and start dumping. Like them buses did the other day. They could have been strapped, too. Trying to start some. Uh, actually, Shida, you started that one, bro. <clears throat> yeah, well, you finished it. Boy, you was looking hard the other day with that strap on the bus. You got it on your Hey, hey man, don't be touching me like that. Look, it's in my mom's closet. Uh, let me check it out. Damn. Hey, boy, watch where you point that man, thing. Man, why you so jumpy, man? It ain't loaded. Besides, man, if a bullet got your name on, there ain't nothing you can do about it. Well, none of those bullets got my name on. Man, relax, man. Check it out, check it out. Yo, 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 is there a problem here? Uh, is there a problem? What's that? Watch out, man. Man, you don't know how to do it. Remember uh, De Niro and Taxi Driver? Yeah. How you do it? You talking to me? Uh, you, you talking to me? Uh, you talking to me? Huh? Well, who else are you talking to? Because I don't see nobody else around here looking this fine. <laughs> yeah, Ooh. Boy, Bobby don't know what he's talking about. Boy, it's the 90s. You have gun you don't get messed with. I'm telling you now, shot man. I ain't going out like no punk. Man, Trey, you know what I love to do? Run up on them fools who tried to jack me for my radio. Wouldn't you? Nah. I like to roll up on those fools who killed my brother Marcus. Next, on South Central. And what's wrong? Your phone broke? Yeah, I haven't spoken to you since Monday. Well, you said everything was on pause. I meant sex, not the relationship. <laughs> well, what's the difference? Let's see what he's hiding in here. Oh, no, sweets. What? No. Okay. I got wicked styles and ways for days and days. Now let me spell my name, the S-H-A-D-R-O-C-K. Yeah, oh, you better hey, apologize. Hey, wait, no, Back up, what's up? Wait, what you wanna do, huh? What's up? What's up? I call him hip -hop. on South Central. I love you. And I need to know if you love me before before I can go any further. Well, like I was saying, 
Where's your ghetto pass? It's right here. Whoa! Now you have been lying left and right. I know something is up with you. What is going on? Trey, you know what I love to do? Run up on them fools who tried to jack me for my radio. Wouldn't you? Nah. I like to roll up on those fools who killed my brother Marcus. sexy voice in a while. <laughs> yeah, I was just... Wait, who is this? Candy? Oh, hey, put Nicole on the phone. Ignorant? Look, hey, I got your ignorant, all right? Hey, put her on the phone. Nicole, it's your boy from the hood. And what's wrong? Your phone broke? Yeah, I haven't spoken to you since Monday. Well, you said everything was on pause. I meant sex, not the relationship. <laughs> well, what's the difference? Oh, see, I... What's the difference? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Andre. Uh, girl, hang up. Why are you wasting your time on that Kmart gangster? Let's call Devin. Shh. You know what? I'm gonna have to let you go. Whoa, 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 hold, hold, hold up. Uh, put Candy on the phone. No, just, just put her on the phone. Hold on. I'll talk to you. <sighs> what you want, Dre? Listen, Miss Bugaboo, you need to quit putting salt all in my game. This ain't got nothing to do with you. It's between me and my girl, all right? Look, Nicole is my best friend, and I don't like the way you've been treating her. What is he saying? Look, I ain't heard no complaints. What you need to do is get your own man and keep your fake Melrose Place want to be ass about my business. Oh, I can't stand you bougie girls. Nicole's bougie. Oh, no, no, no. See, that's where you're wrong. My baby got plenty of class. Take this. I do not know what you see in that boy. He is wrong. Yeah, you just jealous. Get a man. Oh, yeah, baby, I'm back. So, uh, what's up on, uh, the High Life on Friday night? I mean, uh, am I gonna see you? Yeah, yeah, we'll probably be up in there. So, are uh, we, like, gonna be together? Andre, you know what's up. Until you can tell me how you feel about me, it's not happening. <clears throat> yeah, just like I thought. Bye. Oh, wait, 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 Nicole, Nicole! You know, Dion, if I were like you, I wouldn't have this problem. Just stop it. Dang. I can't believe you cooking there. I found turkey from three Thanksgivings ago. <laughs> Moms, you slipping. You're right, Andre. I don't do enough around here, so you get to clean the oven once a month from now on. How about that? Mm. And when you get through with that, go clean my room. See ya. <laughs> get on, Roach. Hey, grab. Don't step away. Right. Enough, up? you two. Go, Tasha. Don't keep Chanel's mother waiting. And you behave yourself while you're there tonight. This ain't over, Mr. Clean. You better watch your back. Bye, Mom. Bye-bye, baby. Hey, Ma, I did the oven. I scrubbed the floors. You know, I even cleaned behind the toilet. That is a stank job. <laughs> so, uh, Ma, can I go out tonight? I mean, I've been your slave for a whole week now. I've learned my lesson. Oh, yeah? And what did you learn? 
I learned that I'm lucky to have a mother who is strong enough to teach me a lesson, but wise enough to know when that lesson is learned. I don't believe you're trying this. <laughs> I always got you. But on the real, come on, let me go to the highlight tonight. Please, come on, don't make a black man beg. Oh, all right. Oh. 10 o'clock. 10? Uh-uh. Then mm -hmm. stay home. Okay, 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 okay. Gosh. And I mean 10 o'clock, or I'll be down there embarrassing your behind on the mic. What's up, Dre, man? Come on, man, we late, man. You said you'd be ready by now. I know. I gotta go get dressed. Oh, so you just knew you were going, huh? Oh, my, you know you love me. <clears throat> me too, Mama Mosley. Oh. Gee. Hey, sweets, I thought you had a date. So did I. Girl, we get to the restaurant and this fool says he doesn't have any money. Oh, no. I'm talking about how he's waiting on his tax return check. <laughs> Where is he now? In the restaurant waiting on me to come out the ladies' room. <laughs> Last time I dated a white man. Seats, you are something else. <laughs> and then some. All right, Mom, we out. I'll see you at 11. 10. 11, I love you. Then stay home. See you at 10. Dang. That boy, I don't know what I'm going to do with him, sweets. <laughs> oh, relax, Joni. He's a good kid. Yeah, but lately he's been sneaking around, not giving me straight answers. He's always got that I'm lying look on his face. It scares me. I don't know what I'm going to do about him. Joni, if you let him, these kids will worry you to death. You been through his things yet? What? Look, every time I want to find out what a man is up to, I go through his things. I got my first two husbands cheating on me that way. Got caught once myself. Oh, sweet, I can't do that. I can't go through his room. Joni, you pay the rent. It's your room. Well, maybe I should go on in there and check on Dia, huh? Oh, sweets, I don't like this. Oh, come on, Joni. You'll feel a lot better when you find out you've been worrying about nothing. Okay. No, this boy does not have condoms in my house, sweets. Now, you ought to be glad he's got sense enough to use them. He better not be using them. Johnny, grow up. Your boy certainly has. Three you're missing. Oh, God. All right. Let's see what he's hiding here. Oh, no, sweets. What? No. Baby powder. <laughs> okay, that's it. Let's go. I can't do this. <laughs> oh, no, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. I think I got something. Oh, yeah. Dearest Nicole. Mm -hmm. Dear Nicole. Yo, Nicole. <laughs> Dear Nicole. I'm real mad you think I'm ghetto macking. Why it got to be all that just because I want to get with you? You ready? Oh, sweets, I don't know if I want to. <laughs> okay. You want to know if I love you. Why else would I lie to my mom and risk getting jacked on the bus just to see you? I'm gonna kill him, sweets. Oh, finish the letter first. It's just getting good. <sighs> Look, I think about you 24-7. What you're doing? What you're wearing, whether you're thinking about me. I dream about us rolling to Venice in your fly-ass Jeep. Our hair blowing in the wind. I just know I want to be with you all the time. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, I love you, Nicole. Andre. Oh, sweets. My baby's in love. When 
when I was young, I used to be little, trying to get bigger. These days they got Nick K running from the trigger. No matter how you figure or how you felt, I'm not trying to be that victim with no breath. Good help from the mic is how I see this. From 94 to the 6, I'm playing tricks on your mind tricks. So don't trip, cause you see me coming up strong. You're dead wrong if you think K won't last long. 19 and 8 showing no fear for 97, 98, 99. I'll still be here. LA here. Uh, you. Well, that was your damn pop should be better looking. Now give me $2. $2? Man, do you know who I am? Man, I'm the Shad Rock and I'm running this place. I don't care if you bed rock or all the damn flint stuff. Like, you better give me two dollars to get all this damn noise up in here. Noise? Man, that is the fattest beat alive. That is Nick Gay, man. That's just James Brown with some fool talking over it. Y'all can't create none of y'all. Man, you just mad because all the floaters are in jail. <laughs> I'm on another mission, so don't start dissing. You get a whipping on the okay. MIC. All the honeys are jacking me tonight, man. Pick one. I'll hook you up. Nah, man, I I'm looking for Nicole. Nicole? Man, leave that alone, man. She got you begging and whipping like a puppy. Okay, don't worry about grown folks' business, young fella. Fine, go and spend the rest of the night begging. Looking for somebody, Andre? Oh, yeah, uh, I'm looking for my girl. She better hurry up. Your mom just called. She said she wants you home by 10. Dang, she rough. <laughs> so where you come from, Nick K and I fall when I know you don't want none. Welcome to the high life. It's three dollars a piece. Oh, no, 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 I got it. No, I got it. Here, this is three for me. What you bring her for? In case you start tripping. Yeah, and you lucky I drove her here. Uh, look, come on, Nicole, let me get you something to drink. And bring me one, too. Uh, yours is in a faucet. I'm not hearing you, Andre. Yaggity, yaggity, yaggity. Uh, come on. Hey, stop pulling on me like you owe me. Nothing's changed, Andre. Oh, okay, well, I guess I should keep what I brought you. What'd you bring me? Uh, you'll see. Andre, I'm not in the mood for your games. Uh, all right, cool then, peace. No, come on, boy. Uh, what did you bring yeah. me? Look who begging now. Look, I'm gonna go ahead and show it to you later on when we're alone, you know? Nicole, let's go. He's here. Who? Huh. His nasty friend, Reekin of Drakkar. Look here, bourgeois. He ain't thinking about you. Rashad is emceeing tonight. Oh, for real? And that's how it's going down, homie. I'm all the way real, so you ain't got a damn thing on me. For the next rapper, I'm gonna kick a little fleas over. You know, he's over for myself. So I DJ Cat Lil drop that fat beat, baby. Baby! Yeah, baby. Well, I'm the shad rock kicking poetry, so they know it's me. Sit back, relax, and let me flow a G. I got wicked styles and ways for days and days. Now let me spell my name, the S-H-A-D, R-O-C-K. Running fools faster than the cars on the freeway. Yeah, I didn't know Rashad was this good. Oh, oh, yeah, my boy can flow. Yeah. I taught him everything he knows. Is that right? That's right. Yeah. Oh, girl, I've been missing you like crazy. You should have left me locked up in that cage because I'm yeah. so you bring Hey, hey, hey look, look, I told you. I'm going to give it to you later when the time is right. Trust me. It'll be worth it. Hey! Let's get a room. Hey! Let's get a room. That doesn't make you a rhymer. You need to find another style. Yeah, kinda. Like this one. Go get one. Better start the fishing. Later for that wishing. Cause Shad's on a mission. I'm taking out sucker duck them seeds like you. I'm out of here like Scooby Doo. Y'all saying, wow. Just a little workout, you know what I'm saying? Just a little workout. But coming to the stage is my boy, Trey Bond, and I. I'm 
Trey. What's your name? I'm here to spit a little game. I have no shame. I'm coming hey, at you straight real from Chillsville. If I start to smile, I'm moving in. Yeah, he was looking pretty really smooth up there. Uh, oh, so it's like that now, huh? Because last week I was Willie Boo And now you done seen a brother rocking a mic and you want to get with me? I got one thing to say to you. So you really thought I was born? <laughs> Now, I'm looking in loco, I'm darker than Coco, I ain't no joke, yo, I'm staying paid in full, cause I got poor, the darker the B, the sweeter the D, the darker the G, the sweeter the P, the lighter the G, the higher the fee, the girls gotta pay to jock me, no tripping or sipping, I can do this pimping without the limping, it's all on my lingo, that's a girl, bet she got my single, or claim she single, if ever we mingo, oh. see bro, well, that's the way it's done, excuse you, get in my way, crazy is all the move, all right, coming with the women, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I know you ain't trying to diss my lady, crazy style, oh, man, I ain't trying to diss nobody, so won't you just Chill, right? Under. Hell no. Nah. Fool, you better apologize. Back up, what's up? Huh? What's up? Yo, man, just squash it, all right? Yo, look, sis, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to diss you. Yeah, like I thought. Come on, Nicole. Hey, hey, where you going, Nicole? Oh, Andre. Huh? What's going on? Come here. Come here, buddy. Hey, what's up? Nothing going on, Bob. Didn't look like nothing to me. What's up, man? Yo, Bob, it's all good, man. Okay, come on, we gotta go. Uh-uh, girl, we just got here, and I'm hanging with Rashad. Yeah, she chilling with the shad right now. <laughs> hey, Nicole, Nicole! Her family's sprung, you can quote me. I stopped counting digs around a C, no G, no low key. Look at the key to being a pimp, it's how I see. For chilling, but every once in a while, I fuck my style. Hey. What you run out of there for? Uh, Andre, get away from me. Get the hell away hey, from me. Hey, what's wrong with you? You could have gotten us killed, Andre. What if he would have had a gun? What would you have done then? You would have shot him? I didn't shoot anybody. No, not this time. Look, what am I supposed to do? I mean, he was that up in your face and he was disrespecting he you. He said move. And he pushed me. Now, you gonna shoot me? You gonna shoot me now? Come on, Nicole. Look, the only reason I carry this thing is for protection when I come to see you. That is bull. Okay, you carry that because you think it makes you hard. Straight rough. Yeah, no. You're nothing but a punk. We're through. What? Come on, Nicole. Don't even talk God, like that. That's so stupid. You had a brother kill behind this mess, and now you're trying to do the same damn thing. Candy was right. You are so ignorant. Come on, Nicole. Get away from Look, me. I'm sorry. Get away you... from Andre. Please, get off the bus. Look, Look I ain't going nowhere. I just want to make sure you're going to get home safe.
Oh, hey, Ma. Hey, baby. What time is it? It's almost 10. You have a good time? No. You want to talk about it? Why does it seem like every time you try to do the right thing, it turns out to be the wrong thing? Why does it seem like the wrong thing is the only thing to do? What are you trying to tell me, Andre? That I don't want you to worry about me. Because I ain't going to do the wrong thing, Ma. I'm snap back in the naps in the rain, okay? Mm -hmm. Hello, Chanel. Hey, Miss Mosley. Uh, my parents told me to tell you thanks again for letting me stay the weekend, and uh, they promised they'd play the $5 slot for you, too, while they were in Vegas. Well, they better play it twice, because I gave them $10. Mm -hmm. I'm on my way to work in five minutes if you all still want to ride to the mall. All right. Come on, Chanel. Ooh, where's Andre? He's dead. Now, quit asking me. <laughs> Sorry, Mama Mosley. Need a hug? <laughs> Get away from me. You're all wet. Ooh. Man, that rain came pouring down quick. Ooh, why not? The two of you better not track water everywhere. Okay, Ma. <laughs> Andre, you keep it up, and I will cut those braids off. Hold on. Time. Where's Dion? Oh, man. <laughs> that boy is not worth all the trouble he causes. Yeah, I know what you mean, Mama Mosley. Yeah, I know I ain't worth nothing myself. <laughs> Honest to God, Andre. He was right behind us when we took off. But if you would have bought him those baby robins like I told you, he would have kept up with us. Where did that stray come from? Oh, uh, 
This is Dion's little homie. Me and Rashad caught it for him. Well, uncatch it. Oh, Ma, well, at least let him stay until the rain stops. Yeah, Mama Mosley, I mean, even you ain't that cold. <laughs> Rashad, Andre, I want that dog out of here. Tasha? Yeah? Um, dry Dion off and dress him, please. Go to Tasha, baby. Hey, what's up, Dre? Get out my face, booger bear. <laughs> Yo, Miles, <laughs> look at my man D. He's laughing. Ooh, I didn't even know the boy had teeth. <laughs> hey, Ma, come on, look at him. Hey, won't you let him keep it? I don't have time to take care of this animal. Oh, well, you don't gotta do it. Me, D, and Tasha take no, care no, of it. No, 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 I ain't taking care of nothing. Yo, Ma, my man over here smiling and grinning. We ain't never seen that. <laughs> look, won't you just let him keep it? Oh, God. Okay. But it's gonna be your responsibility, understand? Yeah, I got I you. mean it. The minute I find any mess on my floor, I'm gonna be messing with you. Hey, Ma, I think I can take you. Oh, you do? No, 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 okay, well, I know, okay, I know yeah? you, <laughs> okay. Yo, man, quiet him down, man. We about to watch the world ghetto premiere of Crooklyn. Crooklyn. Yo, wait, wait, wait. That just hit the theaters last week. How'd you get that hookup? Black Busters, baby. Black Busters. That's the yeah. All the Spike Lee movies come out on bootleg, girl. Buying those bootleg tapes is illegal. Illegal? I think Spike put them out there himself. So you don't have to beg folks for them extra ducking to make that other movie like he did X. You uh, know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hold up a sec, man. I want to make a phone call. Who you calling, man? Nobody. Who you calling, man? <laughs> Nicole. Nicole, what are you, crazy, man? She straight let you loose, right? I know, I just, I just want to see what's up. What's up is that she dumped you, man, and now you begging like a little simp. Man, I can't stand to see you play yourself like that, man. It ain't even like that, Sean. I just want to talk to her just this once. But every time I call, her pops pick up the phone. Pops, man. Girl, you better get up off me before I snatch one of them things out your head. think I'm playing. And go put some clothes on, man. You know I look good. <laughs> Chanel, will you leave them fools alone? Yeah, won't you go somewhere, Chanel? Man, why is Spike Lee always sticking himself in his movies? I mean, he was funny in the first one, but shoot, man. Uh, Nicole. No, uh, hey, what's up, baby? Yeah, uh, can we uh, hook up and... Hello? Hello? N -n Nicole. <laughs> Wait, I know my baby didn't hang up on me. <laughs> Hello? Just look at you, man. You hurt me, bruh. <laughs> is that that girl you were with at Tasha's party? She looked part Indian or something. Yo, this is an A and B conversation, so please see your way out, okay? Why you sprung on her anyway? I bet she ain't even giving it up. Nope, that's why he sprung. <laughs> man, shut up. Yo, Tasha, why don't you put a muzzle on your girl? Don't be dissing my friend, because you getting dissed. Come on, Chanel, let's go make the brownies. Brownies? Girl, I'm watching my weight. You said you wanted to a minute ago. I changed my mind. Man, that bougie girl don't know what time it is, because uh, I know what I'd be doing if you were my man. Chanel! Somebody's jocking. Man, please. Uh-uh, no, no, no. I've been knowing this little girl ever since she was a baby. And I can still smell the milk on your breath. Why don't you crawl away? Oh, uh-uh. One of y'all straight letting loose. Hey, man, what's up? You crawl, man. You ain't me, man. You know I claim, Mom. Huh? Andre, <laughs> the dog and took a dump. What? Did you let the sick dog take a dump on? Oh, oh. Clean it up, Tasha. Uh, 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 Mama said that's your responsibility. You saw it first? Uh, you better clean it up. Get out of here. Welcome to Ujima. Thank you for coming to Black Dollar Days. Your Black Dollar coupon entitles you to 5% off the day's purchases. Thank you for shopping at Ujima and recycling your Black Dollars in the community. Sure, I need to change my Black 50. Where is Lucille? She was supposed to be here 20 minutes ago. If she's smart, she's taking the day off. Man, I hate this black dollar day. Bobby goes berserk. Look at him over there. 
thinking he's Moses, going to lead his people to the promised land with those damn coupons. You should have saw him last year. He was outside pulling people out of their cars. Looked like another damn riot. Joe, Joe, we have some sisters over here who'd like to find out about the soybean meat substitute. Bobby, I have six people in line. <laughs> right, I'll send them right over. Ladies, ladies, come right over. She'll explain everything to you. Bobby, I can't bring people up and talk about soybean meat substitute at the same time. Joan, if Nelson Mandela had that attitude, South Africa wouldn't be on the road to freedom today. Come on, Joan. What do you mean you don't have no pig's feet in this damn store? <laughs> hey, if you want this place to sell some damn pig feet, then donate them hooves you walking on. Come on, Mayo. How many times have I told you not to talk to my customers like that? I'll talk to my mom any way I want. <laughs> I'll see you at dinner, Mom. Don't you be late, baby. <laughs> Oh, you better watch out. He is on the warpath. Lucille, where have you been? You are 22 minutes late. I'm sorry. You know, I wasn't sure I should work on Black Dollar Day. I thought it might be Black Cashier Day, too. And why is it always black this and black that? I mean, what about the brown dollars? There are just as many Latinos in this community. Point taken, Lucille. So why don't you bring it up at our next intercultural community dialogue forum? I told you, I have aerobics class that night. <laughs> Then why don't you start working out on the cash register? Thank you. Thank you for shopping at Ujima. When you support the co-op, you ignore the Latinos in the community. Good afternoon, Ujima. Oh, baby, what is it? I'm really busy. What? Where? Excuse me. Do you have wheat berry bread? Well, you tell him to get that mess up right now, damn it. And I don't want to hear any crap about it. Oops. I'm sorry, Reverend. Uh, we're out of wheat berry, but you can get it at the guy's market on Crenshaw. Thank you. Uh, Reverend Bofu. Uh, Put Andre on the phone. Joe, what are you doing? Andre, oh. I want that mess up off my floor immediately. I don't care. We talked about this. It's your responsibility. Joan, we are trying to keep the black dollars in the community, not send them away. OK, Andre, that's it. I, I want that dog out of my house. I, I don't care. Just do it. What? Tasha, you're a little buster. I swear I should kick your butt. You know what? If you hit me, I'm gonna call my mama right after I call the paramedics to pick your butt up off the floor. Mm, girl, you always trying to get somebody in trouble. Now the dog has to go. Good. Good? Okay, cool. Well, then tell that to Dion. Let's go. Look at him, Tasha. He's almost talking. Hey, he is. This is all your fault. I just want you to know. Come on. Sorry about this, little bro. Ah! Wait, 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 wait. Ah! Wait, 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 wait. Okay, 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 okay. Dion, all right, all right. Sorry, sorry. Ah! It's okay, little bro. Hey. It's all cleaned up, Dre. Anything else you want me to do? Oh, no, no, that's all, baby. All right. Push on. Go on. Go on. Right. Ooh, the room smells piney fresh now. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Sorry. Hey, hold up. I want to call Nicole again. No, no, bro. No, I ain't letting you go out like that. Nope. Man, man, stop playing with the phone. Give me the phone. No, nah, bro. Uh -uh. Yo, Rashad, I don't want to have to beat you down. Look, man, I just want to beat them out the tape, man. Man, quit playing with you. No. Stop playing. No, man. Give me the phone. No. Rashad. No. Wait. Be a little punk, be a little simp, I'm out. Chanel, why Andre said I should put this rag? Look, why you acting so stupid? So are we going out or what? I don't know, and if you call me stupid again, I'm gonna hurt you. Look, why you keep dissing me? We supposed to be hanging. We in the same room, ain't we? Look, I'm tired of watching you throw yourself at my brother. I mean, he ain't gonna get with you, all right? Man, quit trying to cancel my business, all right? You so young acting. Forget you then, I'll go by myself. Bye, bye. Nicole, so you don't ever want to see me again? All right, if you can say that and sound like you mean it, I won't bother you again. Yeah. All right, pick peace. Where's Rashad? 
don't know. He gone. Dre, I really like you. I mean, you're the finest boy I know, and uh, I want you to be my first. I mean, I have older sisters. I know how to act. I'll make you forget all about that bougie girl. Hey, girl, what's wrong with you? Get some self-respect for yourself, gosh. <laughs> Uh, uh. Mom! Tasha, what's wrong? I gotta talk to you. Oh, honey, we're really busy. Can it wait? No! Okay. Open that bag. What happened? Me and Chanel was supposed to do a bunch of stuff this weekend. But all she wanted to do was get with Andre. What do you mean, get with? Dang, Joan, you are old. It means she wants to have sex with your son. Oh, Tasha, you know your brother's not thinking about getting with Chanel. <laughs> Is he? No, he hates her. And I mean, we can, we can never just go out and have fun anymore. She's always got to get all dressed up and put her stupid makeup on. And she don't even look no better. She look like a uh, Tasha, don't put the can on the eggs. Maybe. Sometimes when they all start maturing, they feel like they need to do those kinds of things. Well, I don't like Chanel like this. We're supposed to be best friends. I mean, she's acting like she don't care no more. Thank you. <laughs> Tasha, come here for a minute. Honey, if you're upset with Chanel, you have to tell her how you feel. If you don't say something, she'll never know. But I did talk to her. I told her she was stupid. Tasha, you can't just yell at people. They turn off. They stop listening. You need to tell her what you just told me. I guess. Trust your mama. John. Bye, mama. Can I talk to you for a minute, please? What is it, Bobby? We don't have time for you to conduct your personal business today. Of all days, Joan. Look at this line. Bobby, I was talking to my daughter for five minutes. Jeez. I haven't even taken a break today. Yeah, I haven't had a break either. Lucille, you were 20 minutes late. That was your break. Bobby, I'm taking my break. <laughs> no, 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 ma'am. No, no. We only have three hours to go. Come on, let's push through this. Bobby, that's no, no, I'm just standing sure over there. Hold it, please. Ladies and gentlemen, excuse me for one second, please. Thank you. Can I talk to you for one second over here now? Now look, I know I've asked a lot of you all today, but I'm not asking any more of you than I am willing to give myself. I've been up since 4 o'clock this morning because I know how important this day is to all of us. And Lucille, you're right. Latinos should be included in this day. So next year, we have a black dollar day and a brown dollar day. Joan, I know the family's important. As a single mother raising three kids alone, you know the meaning of sacrifice. So all I'm asking you is to give it your best shot, sister. And Mayo, you of all people should know how this is. You had that little store in the corner for 20 years. Mayo, you are the one who inspired me. me. Bobby, you used that same damn speech to get me to work in this damn co-op in the first place. <laughs> ah, forget it. Come on, let's go back to work before he makes it Black Dollar Month. <laughs> You shot? You can't be disrespecting my mom's in her bed. Hey, man, it ain't even like that, man. All I did was try to get me some. Man, I don't care. Besides, that girl only 14. Look, man, I came back to get my bootleg and she threw it in my face. Besides, I would have been a punk if I didn't take that. You are a punk. Don't be pushing on me, man. <laughs> man. <laughs> Dang, girl, why you acting like this? Man, leave me alone. I mean, he's cute and he likes me. It ain't no big deal. Uh oh, it is a big deal if you get pregnant. I mean, he don't care nothing about you. 
You don't know what you're talking about. Look, I'm your friend. I care about you. You know what? You need to grow up. I mean, God, everybody's doing you it. You know, everybody is not doing it. I'm not. See, that's why I can't talk to you no more. I mean, you act like we still in junior high or something. We are. You just mad because don't know boys want you. Excuse me? But if it means screwing everybody for them to like me, then forget them and forget you too. Now get out! You can't make me get out. Watch I'm me. scared of your tiny ass. Get out of my house! Oh, say you was wrong. Get off me. Say you was wrong. Get off me. Say you was wrong. All right, I was wrong. Hey, what's wrong with her? Stupid dog bit him. Oh. <laughs> Come on, dog. Dion, stay right here. <laughs> man, I'm up out of here, man. There's too much black on black crime up in here. <laughs> in an emergency room. That place is insane. Chanel, make sure you put a pillow under your leg when you go to sleep, okay? Okay. Here, Andre, I'll put him to bed. You go out back and make sure that the animal regulation people came and got the dog. Poor D, can't get a break. Mm. Still awake, huh? Listen, Dion. Snoop had to go away. And he won't be able to come around and play with you anymore. But he told me to tell you that he will always think about you and he wants you to think about him too. Do you understand? Good night. What's the matter, Tasha? I'm sleeping out here. I'm sorry, baby. Yeah, mom still hurts. Yeah, a little bit. Andre, did you get Dion up? Yeah, I just finished dressing.
So this is where all our dishes went, huh? I thought we got robbed. So do you have any plans for tonight? I have some homework to do. Homework, Tasha. You've done homework for the last three Saturday nights. Don't you want to call someone? Did you and Chanel make up? No. Well, then call somebody else. Go to a movie or something. Well, I really want to stay home. I mean, look, I hate my hair. And look, I'm breaking out. And my gear's all tired. Want to do something with me? Mom, I really want to stay home, okay? Okay. Baby. Ooh. Hello, may I speak to, uh, Janice? Oh, hey, baby, what's happening? <laughs> this the Shad Rock. <laughs> yeah, the one you met at the course today? Yeah, that's me, the one y'all was calling Chocolate Thunder. <laughs> yeah, huh? What? Oh, uh, 21. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's my baby face. <laughs> yeah, so I uh, want you and your girl go with me and my boy tonight at the highlight. Yeah, we pick you up. But no, we, we can't. We ain't got no car. <laughs> Give me the phone. Uh, hello. Yeah, what's up? Mm-hmm. Th this is Dre. Yeah, you know the one with the braids and the fade? Oh, oh well, thank you. Uh, I've been told. So, uh, check this out. Why don't y'all meet us up there? Because you know my uh, 5.0 is being detailed. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay. Cool. All right, so uh, we'll see y'all tonight. Yeah, boy! Uh -uh. College material, boy. And hey, you crazy, but I like that in you, Sean. Yeah, boy, you hook up with these college women, you in. They feed you, drive you places, do your homework, and, and you know they got their own crib. Ooh, toe free booty calls, baby! You know when that student loan check came in, what happened? Cha-ching, huh? cha-ching, huh? cha-ching, huh? cha -ching. Huh? Monday! Right, just college. Hey, uh, what's going on? What are y'all so happy about? Oh, uh, we just talking about how lucky we are to live in a country where young people such as ourselves can get a free quality education. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> what are you all doing tonight? Oh, we probably going up to the little high life. I got a great idea. Come here. Why don't you take your sister with you? Ah, uh, go with your bad self, mama. Yeah, you funny. <laughs> I just think it'd be nice if you knocked on her door and asked her if she'd like to go. And what if I don't? Then stay home. What? Oh, no. Hey, Tasha, you don't want to go to the high life with us, right? No. Oh, well. Oh, well. You gave it your best shot. I gave you my best shot. What? No, my see, mom, you ain't got to be doing Come here, honey. Mm. Baby, come here. Don't you want to go to the high life with your brother tonight? No! It'll be fun! <laughs> Tasha, you're going. Oh! <laughs> Tasha, come on, you're going. Oh, hell no, not with me. No, no, you gotta come up at that back. What's wrong with it? What's wrong? Look at your head, it's too small. All I can see is those big bugged eyes. Aw, baby, don't you look cute? Aw, mama, don't say that. She look like Elma Fudd. <laughs> look at that hat, look stupid. Andre, look there, it's off. Now, can we go? <sighs> Sweetheart. Cheer up. I want you to have a good time tonight, okay? Mama, don't be too late picking me up, okay? I'll be there at 10 o'clock. Now take care of yourself and stick with your brother. You know you ain't gonna be winning that, huh? <laughs> And you take care of your sister. <laughs> Believe me, ain't nobody gonna wanna mess with her. Hey, now, sweet Hey, baby. What's wrong with Tasha? Her bottom lip is scraping the ground. Growing things, girl. <laughs> Dion, sweets is here. Come on in out of the doorway. Oh, no, I can't. I got to keep an eye on my car. It's crawling with grandkids. Oh, no, Joni. You're not going to make that boy walk around with a sign around his neck. Looks like his picture should be hanging in the post office. Honey, if he gets separated from the group, I want people to know who he is. Oh, honey, he is going to be fine. He's going to be with me. Okay, sweet. Okay. Okay. So now, 
Saturday night. No kitties. But you got on your plate. Girl, I'm going to sit back and enjoy my house. Your house? You could be spending it with something a little warmer than that. Like who, sweets? You know who. Isaiah, the only man you let sit foot in your room the past five years. Oh, him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I better go. Goodbye, y'all. Bye. Here? Well, we were supposed to have dinner tonight. Oh, oh, I know. I should have called him to confirm. I'm sorry. That boy forgets everything. I made him take his sister to the High Life tonight. Oh. Well, that's okay. Well, come on in. <laughs> Excuse the mess. <laughs> this is the first night I've had the house to myself and I don't know how long. What? No Dion? Sweets took him to Disneyland to the light parade thing. Oh, I see. Well, you deserve a night off. <laughs> hey, Joan. How about you let me uh, take you out for a nice dinner? Ray, doesn't that go against the parent-mentor regulations? Yes, it does. But as of this moment, I am no longer Andre's mentor. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we could bend the rules for tonight. Okay, give me just a minute to freshen up. I won't take long. Take your time. I'm not going anywhere. Good evening, folks. Hi. Name? Uh, McHenry. How long is the wait? Uh, about 45 minutes. Listen, Joan, I'm starving. We can be at the Ivy in 15 minutes, and they have great catfish. Well, okay. Joan? Joan, hey, I thought that was you. Isaiah, what a surprise. Good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you, too. <laughs> oh, Isaiah, um, meet my son's mentor. Ray McHenry. <laughs> Dr. Ray McHenry. Yeah, how you doing? Right. Uh, Ray, this is Isaiah Washington. He distributes food to the co-op. So, uh, are you two waiting for a table? No, uh, we're leaving. The wait's too long. No, no, don't leave. Listen, why don't you join me? I've got a table. You've got a table? You came in after us. Oh, I know, but I'm a regular here. See, my boy Brad here hooks me up. What do you say? I would love the company. It's, uh, it's really up to Joan. Well, you know, I did have my heart set on some five seas catfish. <laughs> well, whatever you want, Joan. <laughs> skills to fight the war right here in our own community. Come on in and enjoy yourself. Tasha, is that you under there? <laughs> it's good to see you. Does your mom know you're out this late? I'm with Andre and Rashad. They still out in the parking lot talking to their stupid friends. Yeah! Once again, it's over! That good time of night, low. Hey, I got the new Warren G cut. Raise up to my car. And check it out. Oh, Ben, Dre, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Andre, where you going? Hey, nowhere. What you gonna mingle, man? Look, I know what y'all about to do. Look at Shanti. You can hide right here. I ain't gonna do that. I'm just gonna hang. Okay, I'm telling you. Hey, you ain't gonna tell
Okay, man, I'm gonna just stay here, man. I'll get back with Somebody else, sister. Hey, you. <laughs> so, uh, let me know. Are those contacts, are those your real eyes? Well, if you can't recognize the real thing, then you can't hang. Yeah, Dre, relax, man. You never think all these sisters is real. Look, um, quit tripping, because we really believe. Now, where are we really going? Oh, uh. I was thinking about we start off in a ride, you know, slide in little R. Kelly, get to know each other a little bit better, maybe do a little one-on-one, -on -one, two on two, however you want to do it, you know, because I, I don't see nothing wrong with a little uh, grind. <laughs> That's right, just a little bit, you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, let's break. Give me some juice, please. What's wrong with you, Grammy? I don't know nobody here, and I want to leave. Well, that makes two of us. Hey, rapper girl, come over here. Rapper girl, this is Grammy. Grammy, this is rapper girl. Now you know somebody. What's up? Don't you go to my church? Yeah, I seen you there. You sang in the choir? Yeah, I'm Tasha. I'm Nick K. Hey, uh, she meet my boy, Scoey. Scoey, this is Tasha. Hey, Tasha. Hi, Scoey. It's a fat hat you got on. Oh, thanks. Dang, you got the whole cycle, huh? Yeah. Hey, sit down. Wait a minute, you dropped something. What? Your conversation, baby. Now, let's pick it up over here. Joan, would you like to try some of this snapper? Best in the city. Okay, thanks. Um... Mmm, that's mm. wonderful. <laughs> I catch those up on the island every summer. Last year, I reeled at a 10-pounder. Mm, I didn't know you fished, Ray. I do many things, Joan. <laughs> Yeah, I, I take my boat off the coast of Catalina sometimes. I do a little fishing myself. Well, I don't have time to fish in L.A. My medical practice keeps me so busy, I have to go to the East Coast just to get to the water. <laughs> I have a little beach house on Martha's Vineyard. Oh, really? I hear it's beautiful there. Oh, yes, it is. I actually was thinking of inviting Andre up for a week this summer. Oh, that would be wonderful. Uh, you're welcome to come, too. I'd love it if you'd be my guest. Now that's a tempting offer, Ray. <laughs> now, let me understand this. You're Andre's mentor, right? That's right. I do what I can to help out. I see that. Joan, I, I'm sorry I never got a chance to do those repairs in your bedroom. They really should be tended to. You were in Joan's bedroom? Why, yes, I was. Does anyone want dessert? Ray, shouldn't you get that? Someone could be bleeding or something. Uh, the phone is by the men's room. <laughs> that won't be necessary. <laughs> By the men's room? <laughs> Excuse me. I'll be right back.
Yo, it's uh, <clears throat> quite a coincidence me running into you tonight. I've been thinking about you a lot. And what have you been thinking? Well, I've been thinking I'd like another chance. You know, maybe I could come over some night with your kids, and maybe you and I could work our way back to where we left off. Okay. Remember? I remember. <laughs> <laughs> so how about hooking up later, after you say goodnight to Dr. Ray? Oh, I can't. Ray's going to take me to pick Tasha up after dinner. What about next weekend? Oh, no emergency? Don't have to leave. Actually, I've got to run. I have to check on one of my buildings. I manage several properties. Well, good for you. <laughs> and don't worry, I've got the check. Already taken care of. <laughs> Joan? Good night. night. Uh, listen, Joan, what I'm about to say breaks every parent mentor rule there is, but I really care about you. And I know you're not there yet. Ray, I... You don't have to say anything, and there is absolutely no pressure. I will be there for you and Andre, just like I always have. I wanted you to know that. So... I'll go and bring around the car, and uh, we'll go pick up Tasha. Okay? Okay. My side crusher, never trust a buster. Gus and his mother and his brother. It's My goodness. I hardly recognize this place. Yeah, it reminds me of my old college days. I was the greatest last poets fan there was. Yo. <laughs> my, 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 sister, don't you look lovely tonight? Well, thank you, Bobby. <laughs> oh, how are you, my brother? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, Ray, this is Bobby Devers. He runs this place. Bobby, this is Dr. Ray McHenry. Doc. Well, that's great. We need more strong brothers in the medical community. Where are the kids? Yeah, here having fun somewhere. There's Tasha. If you want to go in and go out, you gotta see what this is about. Shot, I told you to hurry up. Oh, see, my mom's is already here. Man, baby, you wouldn't let me up the back seat, man. There's a shed right there. You wouldn't understand. She's over there talking to Tasha. Bet that little bust over there salting me out. So you're having a good time after all, huh? Yeah. <laughs> uh, who's your friend? Hi, I'm, I'm Scooby. Hi, Scooby. How are you? Let me know, Mama. It's Scooby. Mama, why don't you go get some juice or something? You're embarrassing me. Hey, Mama. Hey, popular. Hey, what's up, Ma? Hey, what you doing here, Ray? Since my dinner plans were so completely canceled. Oh, snap. My bad. Your bad, all right. No, where were you? I told you to stay with Tasha. Mama, Mama, he was right here all night. Yeah, you know, I'm just over there with you, like, body. Yeah, yeah, it's all good, Mama. Yeah. Okay, well, Tasha, you ready to go? It's getting late. Oh, Mama, can I stay just a little while longer, please? Uh, yeah, Joan, let's hang a minute. I mean, uh, it's all good, right, Andre? Ah, oh, look at you, Ray, trying to get here. All right. Come on, Joan, let's get a drink. Yeah, go and get a drink or something. <laughs> So I guess you're gonna wait till we get to the crib to bust me out, right? Man, I ain't got time to be worried about you. I got new things going on right here. Love with dark skin and a best friend. Cause there was nothing wrong with love and you and if you didn't know what you do. Now you gotta have control of your own game. One thing you don't think you can do. Now terrain is what you And black on black love is such a beautiful thing. trying to go up there and sing. Now, boy, you know I can sing. You go. You yeah. ain't down.
Nice clothes, real good looking, but he's already tookin'. Written down in the books for a hoe when you not knowin'. Two, four, seven, he's going Back, back, forth, and forth. A lot of other things in life besides boys, you gon' get yours in the years to come. Till come, your F R E N D is the downest one. Down with me, I'm down with you. If you ain't down, down with me. Yeah.